Jiggity Chanka lads and lads, what's going on everyone? It's the Flying Pig here on Flying Pig United. <laughs> With another, no, Flying Pig Gaming, sorry. With another cheeky little stream for you, lads and lasses. We're back here with a raw one for some FIFA Ultimate Team UT Champs Phil Faction, my son. Oh, yes. Let's be having you. I hope you're all good tonight, guys. Thank you for joining us. Shout out to all the posse in the vertical live tonight. We've got a few legends in the vertical live. Syntax, DBR, John Blatchford. Thank you, Ian McKenzie, for subscribing. Yes, if you're watching in the vertical live and you want to watch in the regular live, click on the channel. Click on my channel, click on live, and watch the regular live, if you want, or stay in the vertical live. And everyone in the regular live, welcome into the stream here tonight. Simon Warner. What's happening, Stuart Stormtrooper Warner? David Hills. The Hoopman, my son, getting in here from Bonnie, Scotland. Hey. Jason Chapman, let's be having you, my son. Dean loves stuff. The Hoopman. Lee Heesman. Guys, let's just get some love in the live chat there for Lee Heesman, my friend. It's tough, tough times, man, when uh, there's those... You know, there's uh, milestones and things like that. Easter's another one, mate. You know, it's just sad, isn't it, mate? I feel you. Let's get some big love in there for Lee Heesman, man. Stay strong, brother. Stay strong. Uh, Simon Warner, let's go. Benjamin, the hoop man. Palmarius, Simon. Duke of Rodtown, Welly. What's going on? Yes, Adam Cookman. Shane McCarthy. Haven't had an Easter egg today, actually, mate, believe it or not. But I did have a Chinese takeaway, lad. Conti Kev. Andy Young, Dean, Sharp777, exclusive, getting in there, Raw, my son, what's good? Prop by Palmarius, yes, bro. Kieran, John Holiday, good Easter weekend. Yeah, just chilling here, John. Let's have a rematch, being another whoopee. Sure, I'll give you a, I'll give you a warm up here, John Holiday, mate, yeah. Uh, you got me at a bad time the other day. You're probably going to get me at a bad time today as well. You know why, John? Because you're that type of person, aren't you? You don't want to look at the pig in the middle of flow, in form, when he's playing well and go, hey, let's challenge him now. Oh, no. You have to do it when I'm really unwell and I haven't even played any FIFA for a couple of days, mate. That's the sort of guy that you are, John. But fair play, I'll treat you as a warm-up, lad. Yeah, absolutely. Hassan. Let's go. Connor. <laughs> Connor Walsh. Matthew Doyle. Yes, Farabi Fuad. Alex Walker. JRA, Shane, everyone, do us a favour at the start of this stream. Smash that like button on the stream. Over on this stream and the vertical stream, Sambo, Johnny Kinsella, you're representing the vertical live over there. So big up yourselves. Share it, like it, subscribe, and all that. Nice one. A Maya, let's go. John Boy Cat, let's go. Yes. D1, hello, hello. Electra, let's be having you. William McDonald, get in there, William McDonald, lad. Let's smash some fools up, sir. Simon Almeida, yes, bro. Al Camo, Joe W, Benjamin, Jamie. Yes, Callum, what's up? Shane, nice Brentford, when you were 85 quid yesterday. Scumbag, you're a scumbag. That's all right, Andy, you can easily just smash the thumbs up button again. Miz 528, I'm ill, Electra. Yeah, that's why there was no uh, Arsenal City stream earlier on, because I was just, I've been ill. You know, I was pretty ill yesterday in the, in the watch and I just took it out of me, guys, took it out of me. Definitely ill today. Thank you, Leviathan Oasis, for subscribing to the channel, mate. Johnny, you packed Bobby. You packed Sir Bobby. Go on, Johnny. Big dubs for you, lad. All I want to do is do it. Big dubs, big dubs. All I want to do is do it. Big d Oh, shit. Not the snowman. All I want to do is... Oh, fucking controller's gone for a button as well. Shit. Um, yeah, nice one, though. That's awesome, mate. What a big dub right there. Thank you, Leviathan Oasis, for following us, by the way. Yeah, if you guys are new like Leviathan, you can hit the subscribe button and get yourself involved in the chat. I don't know, D1, what I'm doing, mate. We'll see. We are going to have a pack opening if we get to 169 likes later. If we get to 169 likes, guys. So everyone, smash that like button on it. I've got 40 gash packs to open here. 40 packs, which we're going to open, plus more packs after we've played more games and done some SBCs. So probably like 50 packs or something. So yes, do us an honour. Do us the honour of smashing the like button at the start of the show. Hey, nice one, Johnny Holiday. Let's go. I'll give you a warm-up game here, my son. Hey, Benjamin Turner, did you enjoy your spankings the other night, mate? Benjamin invited me to a game offline. I've done him 5-0. He's rage quit. He's rage quit in after, like, 20 minutes. Then, we, I've, I've, I, then he's invited me again. I'm like, hang on, you've just played me and we can quit after 20 minutes. But okay, I'll give you another game. Then I made him rage quit by half time. And then he's, like, inviting me again. I'm like, hang on, I'm not giving you a third game. I just battered you 10 in an aggregate, man. Do one. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Benjamin. <laughs> nice one. Thanks for the games, mate. Thanks for the games, bro. <laughs> anyway, um, okay. Uh, let's do this. Zone in, bro. No excuses. Hey, do you know what? There are excuses, John. 
I'm not feeling too well tonight, mate. I'm so cold. I'm cold. I'm going in cold. I've already set up the excuses beforehand, boss. Mary Kate Heesman welcoming you, legend. That's what's going on. I'm guessing you're actually Heesman's missus. Yes, lad. Yes, lass. As much as I didn't want to draw, draw to City. Yeah, it's a great result, lad. Hey, well done to Arsenal. Well done to the Arsenal Holands, guys. Solid stuff from them. Well done to the Arsenal Holands. You know? I'm pleased for them. I'm pleased for them. They've stopped City going top. Giving them a chance still of competing for the title. Unfortunately, they have let Liverpool go top, though. So you shut the bed there, didn't you, Arsenal? But, uh, you know, it is what it is. It's decent. It's a decent result, that. Decent result. I am on Xbox, Stuart. Right, guys, listen, we're playing uh, John Holiday here. He wants a bit of focus. Uh, I'm going to batter this twat. <laughs> That's all I can say. Let's batter it, mate. Now, big up John Holiday. Seems like a great guy. He's also given me some new tactics lately, uh, of which we're going to destroy him with his own tactics here, mate. So... Here we go. Let's lock in a little bit here. There are no excuses. Come on, Georgie. Come on, Georgie, lad. Yes, Georgie, you're on side, Georgie. Yes, boys. Oh, come on. A little bit of a better start from us here. Only three points within all three at the top. Anything can happen. True, it's a mad season. They're shaping up to be a good run-in for the neutral anyway. Uh, because yesterday, like you say, it could go one of three ways. Pretty, pretty awesome when it's, when it's like that. Pretty boring when you get like a <clears throat> Premier League campaign where somebody's just like ahead at the front by like 15 points at this stage. You know, it does happen, doesn't it? City have dominated a bit over the years. It does happen. Now what you're saying, John Holiday, mate? I just wasn't thinking the other night, mate. I was reading the chat. I was distracted. Now I'm going to batter you, John Holiday, sir. Oh, yes, John. Oh, yes. You best be ready for this, mate. Oh. Yeah, that's right. When I played did you there, John. Nice one. Thank you, Mr. Pork Chop. How are you doing tonight, bro? John Blackford says, smash this melt, lad. <laughs> yeah, I qualified off stream, Andy. Yeah, I just literally after the stream, I just played one game and won it. Yeah, might as well. Do it with no pressure, you know what I mean? Get the job done, got the job done. I'm qualified, don't worry, I'm qualified. We're all qualified. We only needed one more win. We only needed one more win. I got the job done, mate. No dramas. All good. Oh. Well done, Maldini. It's good stuff from Maldini. Hello, F the Man. What's happening? Yes, F the Man. And Insidious Inflation. How are you doing? Long time legend. Insidious Inflation. When Man, you were winning leagues easy. I loved it. It was nice days, weren't it? Yeah. I mean, you know, you can't win it all the time. If you literally won it all the time, it would make, it would just, it wouldn't even, you know, it would just become slightly less sweet, wouldn't it? What makes Manchester United's successes in the 90s and noughties of that period so good is that we had, you know, 20 odd years of, of, of gashness before that. And, and if Manchester United were to go on again, oh shit, we've let him in there. Fair play to you, my son, you've done well. If Man United were to go on and have a good success of, um, you know, a good period of success again now or in the future, we would appreciate it that heck of a bit more just because we have had 10 years or even by the time we're actually successful again, a lot more than that, of uh, pure gash mediocrity. So it does make it sweeter. So it would be boring if you just won it every year, wouldn't it? G-Wolf, what's going on, my son? Yes, G-Wolf. Oh, how you doing? And Dave the Gamer, a couple of legends getting in. What's going on, Dave? Yeah, my Easter was all right, Dave. How's yours going? Liverpool scummers are the worst. Yeah, good shout. I mean, they're, they're scum, aren't they? <laughs> But at least, at least we can respect to their achievements. I can, anyway, because they've done it the right way. Whereas Man City, Chelsea, those cheating bastards. I don't respect those clubs, mate. They're, they're scum cheating bastard clubs, mate. Scum cheating bastard clubs. John's done well. John's done well here. John's done well, lad. So he's got that new Ginola card. It's looking very tasty. Oh, come on, lads. It's pathetic. Oh, what the fuck's up with that gasatic defender, you fucking shite, bro? Goodness me, what the fuck? Who is that twat there, though? Fucking Maldini, was it? Just gets easily done there. You're a fucking mugland. That defender, mate, whoever that was, you're fucking shite. My God. Oh, bastard. 
All right, he's done me there, guys. He's done me there. All right, come on. Just a warm-up game, this one. Just a warm-up game. First game of the night for me. He's, he's, get, he's, taking, he's getting me cold here, mate. But regardless, we're going to batter this twat. Can't defend the king. There's only one king around here, my son. It's the king Cantona, mate. Don't you call dear on me the king, man. Are you doing... Uh, what? Oh, no. I'm so sorry to hear that there, Jason Chapman, man. Let's get some love hearts in there for Jason, dude. Dude. Those milestones are saddening, aren't they, man? Absolutely. Oh, my goodness me. Berbatov with an insane header. Oh. Ah. Oh. Dude, Berbatov, what an attempt. Decent. Almost. Great save. Oh, shit. Ah! Are you meant to change tactic? Yeah, I already have done, actually, yeah. Ezio Auditore, what's good, my friend? Hello. Welcome aboard the Bacano Express, lad. No way! I've shat it! I should have just basically, um, you know, uh, got the job done. There. <laughs> uh, Andrew says, did Lani qualify for you? Definitely not, mate. I literally only needed one win out of two. I mean, you, you underestimate the pig, mate. Already won three of them on stream yesterday. And just easily 1-1 one, one off stream. It's always easier off stream, mate. But easily 1-1, one, one, easily qualified. No dramas at all, mate. Oh, no dramas at all. Oh, dear. Hello, Uma Asim. Yes, welcome back. And you've been away from the chat for a bit. Hey, how are you doing? I hope you've had a good few weeks, mate. What's good? Fuck you. <laughs> Get in there, John Holiday. Hello, Triple R. Thank you, John Blatchford, to smash these melts. Okay, I will. Smash the like, guys. If you're just getting in, hit the like button. Uh, let's get this sucker to a 100 likes just like that. Subscribe if you're new as well. We're on our way to 5,200 subscribers. So subscribe if you're new. We're only about 15 away. Hit the old sub up if new, my friends. Oh, hell yeah. Give me a hell yeah in the live chat. And that's the bottom line. Because Stone Cold Piggy said so. What? Come on, then, let's beat this guy. I really want to beat this guy with his own tactics. Especially after his, uh, what's the word, his smugness the other day, mate. Thinking he actually did something when he played a vulnerable pig. Do you know what I mean? Who is this guy? <laughs> Didn't do nothing, John, mate. Hello there, Mr. Spliffy. What's good? Okay, there's the halftime whistle. Good half, mate. Good half. It's a real good half. I appreciate you, John. Let's get some love in there for John Holiday, mate. I appreciate that half of football from you there, mate. It's a tight affair, this one. It's a close game. What's your name all about, mate? Have a cry, Din. What? <laughs> What's your name all about, mate? John says, good after, mate. Yeah, good after, John. Nice, Andy. You evoed that new color card. 91 rated now with a shadow. 95 pace. 99 defending. That's insane, dude. Wow. That's actually insane. My fault. Look at that. Steven says, I drank a beer. What? Nice. What beers you drinking? No Easter eggs today for me, hoop man. No. Oh, and Nunes is some threat. Watching WrestleMania? Uh, I don't know, mate. Probably. I do tune in for the big events like WrestleMania, Royal Rumble, but that's about it. Although I did uh, watch, like, did you see that whole The Rock making Cody Rhodes bleed segment the other day? Smash a one in the chat if you saw that. It just popped up on my YouTube, so I watched it. Fucking great. They've gone back to, like, the Attitude Era or something, man. Last time I watched WWE, it was some proper kiddie shit. Oh, no! Last time I watched WWE, it was some proper kiddie, kiddie shit. This time they got Wicked The Rock just handing out brutal assault to Cody Rhodes, man. And, like, cutting him, bleeding him open, he's bleeding and shit. He's dropping F-bombs. The Rock's dropping F-bombs. It was like watching some late 90s vibe, mate. It was sick. It was sick. That's what they need to do. They need to make it like that again. Raw, gritty. You know, that's what they need to do, mate. It was so much better when it was like that instead of this kiddie shit. So, yeah, I think that's really good. Is, does that mean the Attitude Era is on its way back then, guys? Oh, fucking hell. Hang on, hang on. He's done me. He scored a goal against me, guys. I wasn't really paying attention there. Shit. Okay, come on. 
You saw it, did you, G Wolf? Yeah, it was decent, wasn't it? It was decent. The Rock doing bits, lad. It's almost like he's an actor or something, you know? <laughs> he's decent. Auditioning for his next movie out there, my son. G Wolf says the Rock is a sellout. Why is the Rock a sellout then, G Wolf, lad? Why do, why, do, why do you say that? I mean, I say he's the sort of guy who's just a super rich, like the most paid, highest paid actor in the world, right? And he's still going back to do the WWE, mate, because he loves it. I mean, I'm sure he's getting paid quite well by them, but it's pales in comparison to what he would get paid as a movie star. So, you know, in terms of like those one-off appearances and stuff. So, I don't know. What, uh, you know, fair enough, though. <laughs> you know, I don't know. I mean, you know. One thing I was a bit disappointed with, I um, don't know if you guys saw The Rock on Joe Rogan. Did you see The Rock on Joe Rogan? Yes or no? The Rock on Joe Rogan, guys. So I was looking forward to that. I saw that pop up. Oh, shit. Dwayne The Rock Johnson on Joe Rogan. This is going to be sick. Worst episode of Joe Rogan ever. Because The Rock's so much, like, he's so, like, political. He's so, like, on the fence about everything. He just doesn't have an opinion on anything, mate. He's too fucking, like, he's just way too, like, impartial and he sounded like Barack Obama or some shit was on the fucking show just being like just before an election and they got to be careful what they say about everything that's what it was that's what it felt like which was a shame because I was looking for some raw like rock stories and stuff and you just ended up getting like you know some like real middle of the road type almost political clobber mate it was guff absolute guff which is a real shame because I would have liked to have seen you know Oh, what a finish! No! Jesse Talks Football, you legend. That's how you doing? Welcome in. I hope you've been good. Let's go. How you doing and how are your scumbag leads getting on there? <laughs> no, how you doing? How you doing? Great to see you. Great to see you. You lost, lost respect for The Rock when he endorsed Biden. Oh, fair enough. Well, that's, a, that's a, you know, as I say, some more political shit. I mean, yeah. I guess you've got to endorse someone, don't you? But... Um, it's hard to really, you know, it's like, oh, my God. The options in America in terms of who's actually candidate. Sorry, I don't want to offend any Americans. Probably shouldn't even get political at all. But it's like, who are you choosing? You've got a bag of shit or a slightly bigger bag of shit? <laughs> you know what I mean? Which are, who are you choosing? I guess the lesser bigger bag of shit. But, you know, still, those are some slim pickings out there. Oh. Because he should be fighting his cousin Roman Reigns. Instead, he acknowledges his tribal chief to act. G-Wolf. G-Wolf. <laughs> you, you, you realise it's not real, right, mate? <laughs> you realise it's not actually real, right? Okay. Just, he's a sellout because he should be fighting Roman Reigns. Oh, come on, mate. Didn't Cody Rhodes or... Didn't... didn't oh, I don't know what the legit... I, don't, I haven't been following it, but what? <laughs> what a ball that is, guys. What a ball that is. Fucking have it. Get in there, my son. It's delicious. We've done him right. 3-3. Three, three. Let's see if we can make a couple of substitutions now then. Get a few fresh legs on to batter this clown. Let's go. Let's go. Oops. Wrong move there. Uh, we're actually going to put Eto on then up there for... We'll go Hoyland and Eto, mate. Fresh legs at the top of the pitch there. Thank you very much, Arthur's Gaming Channel, for subscribing there, bro. Uh, oh, yeah, nice one. John Shock says, uh, Pig, uh, the Renford Rejects reference in your last watch song was hilarious. Nice one. Yeah, Renford Rejects, man. Who, who, who doesn't? Who remembers that, guys? Yes or no, Renford Rejects was a classic. Absolute classic on Nickelodeon back in the day. If we don't beat Chelsea, I'm going to break up the house. This place is already steady on there, man. Thank you, Elliot Manduna. Same to you, boss. What's good? Yeah. Nice one. By the way, I do want to give a shout out to Jesse Talks Football, actually, because I see her on uh, on YouTube putting in shifts. Do you know what I mean? Like, fair play you, Jesse. Like, you are doing YouTube the right way. I think you've got, like, over 400 subs now, you know, considering you've started on nothing. That's fucking great in a short space of time. That's fucking great. Keep it, keep it going. And I just see you on there streaming, like, loads. So fair play you putting in the hours. That's what you've got to do. you got to grind it out. you got to grind that shit out. At the start of YouTube, you know, you really do. You really do always, in fact. Get in there, have some of that John Holiday. <laughs> yes, mate. Anyway, shout out to Jessie Talks Football, guys. Go check her out. Give her a sub up. Because, uh, yeah, she's out there doing bits, man, on, uh, on YouTube. I see it. I see it. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep that up. Oh, what's happening? Oh, he's making some substitutions now, is he? How do you get good players? So moves, you just got to play the game, really, bro. You got to play the game, grind the game. You've also got to, uh, you know, uh, what's the word? Uh, 
buy packs, mate. <laughs> I'm joking. You don't have to buy any packs. You just got to play a lot of games, grind SBCs, do a lot of grinding. I've done him, John Shocks. Yes, lad. Can't see the minute on the screen. Oh, can you not? Oh, you're watching it on the vertical live. Yeah, you can't see much on the vertical live. Go over to the regular live, Blazing Sorry. It's better, mate, to be honest. I've just got that vertical live there to, you know, just in case anybody's like watching through the YouTube shorts bit, basically. Because a lot of people are doing that these days, watching a lot of shorts on YouTube, so. How can anyone lose to use the GTA 5 Golf Caddy? Hey, mate, give us a game, bro. I'll fucking destroy you. Everybody says that until they actually play me and then they realise I'm fucking half decent. I'll fucking batter you, GTA Golf Caddy, lad! Uh, who do you think you are, son? Oh, he's almost chucked the game away there. Stuart Strong, Super Waller. You had a good one yesterday. You saw the new Ghostbusters movie. Oh, it was well good. Oh, nice, man. I'm going to have to check that out. Oh, lovely, Aaron. Roast lamb for Easter. Oh, lovely. Let's go. G hey, mate. GTA 5 Golf Caddy. I'll fucking batter you, sir. Go on, then. Add me up, mate. Guys, get an exclamation mark Xbox in the live chat, would you, mods? Please get an exclamation mark, you know, whatever it is. Ex uh, oh, shit! Oh, yeah? Big Adama says, fuck you. Smothering you with your own tactics, John on a day. Smothering you, lad. Oh, well, well defended there, well defended. What a tackle that is, eh? Oh my goodness, what a tackle. He's on side. Come on, let's finish him. Finish him! Oh. Finish him! Oh! Late batterings here. I think we've got the job done. Not enough time there for him to go up the other end and get an equaliser. Good game, though. Great game, in fact, John Holiday, mate. Yes! I got one back on you, John. GG's. Let's get some GG's in there for John. Cracking game of football, lad. Cracking game of football, I've got to say. Well done. I enjoyed that. Umes' opponent is panicking. We put the pressure on at the end there, didn't we? Drowsy says, if you control the United team in real life, we would win the league. <laughs> I don't know about that, dude. Have you ever seen me play career mode with Man United, mate? Didn't go too well. On legendary mode. Hey, thank you, Munya, for subscribing. Thank you, Steamboat. Yes, guys. Thank you for subscribing to the channel there, guys. I appreciate you all. Thanks for subscribing and getting involved. Thank you, Moose, says you the best. Thank you, Moose. Hey, Pat Marius, getting in there raw, son. Yes. Love it. Getting in there raw, my son. Pat Marius, you beast. Let's go. I like it raw. Ooh, baby, I like it raw. Ooh, baby, I like it raw. Okay, you're inviting me now. King Cannabis is your name. Okay, bro. Let's go. I'll try and... Uh, it's not actually... Wait a second. Maybe it's come through here. No, okay. Let me just try and add you up, actually. That's cool. I'll add you up. Nice one, Aaron. Yeah, that's it there. King Cannabis. <laughs> love it. Love it. Okay. I'm going to fucking destroy you, mate. Here he is. Oh, we're already we're already friends. We're already friends. We're already friends, bro. Have we played before then? We're already friends. Right, yes, if you want to send us an invite, please do. Or I can try and invite you real quick. But I'm gonna batter you, lad. You know, it's funny, isn't it? People coming in and giving it the old Billy Biggin. Reckon they can batter me. Hey, no worries, Jesse Talks Football. I appreciate you. Yeah, keep it up. I see you putting in the uh, the shifts there. That's good stuff, you know. If you build it, they will come definitely. Oh, it's already growing with it every time I see it anyway. Uh, big up drowsies. Yeah, nice one. I'll give you an invite now then, yeah. I'd better slap him up. Hey, where's John Holiday's last comment, though? Did he say GG's? He better have said GG's, mate. Or has he just got to cry, has he? No comment from John Holiday post-game. What? What's going on there, John, lad? You're supposed to say GG's or something, mate? Have you just gone off to cry, lad? What's going on, John? Oh, no, there he is. He says, <laughs> sorry, John. He says, good game, good game, my son. Good luck tonight, mate. Thank you very much. I enjoyed it a lot. John Holiday, big up yourself, lad. Remember to trade crossplay off when you start a chance. Oh, great shout as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
You're an old gen, not sure if it let me in. GTA 5 golf game, why the fuck are you wasting my time and my life, bro? Dude, oh, oh, you're about to be at the game. You're not even playing the same fucking game as I'm playing. You're playing old gen, mate. Dude, any old twat can win on old gen. There's a bunch of fucking spotty little 12-year-olds in fucking, you know, fucking, I don't know, fucking, fucking Afghanistan playing on old gen still, lad. What the fuck's the matter with you? Fucking wasting my time. Hey, Shadow Gaming, what's going on, Shadow Gaming? I'm joking, by the way, GTA, man. But you are talk you are guff though, lad. What are you doing? Wasted my time, lad! We can't play old gen people, mate! Can't play old gen people! Stop stuttering. Oh, oh, do you know what, GTA 5 golf caddy, mate? How about f f f f f f f f f fuck off, bro? Yeah? I didn't stutter. Um Captain Wilcox says, I'll get my revenge next time we play Piggy. Lucky last time. Yeah, no. Definitely not, mate. Definitely not. Nothing lucky about it, mate. Pure skill and unadulterated rawness is what's happened there. Oh, yeah. Nice one, Adrian Feeney. Thank you, Moose. There's nice glasses. Shadow Gaming, welcome into the Vertical Live, you legend. Let's go. How you doing tonight? Yes, indeed. All right. I guess we'd better play champs then, guys. So I'm qualified for champs. Let's get stuck into some raw champs here. And, uh, yeah, here we go. Get a FIFA tournament set up. Yeah, good shout. Good shout. Good shout for midweek, that is. Good shout for midweek. I'll have you pig. Let's go, says Eric. Uh, 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 uh. Do you know what? ETH the man. Sorry, I, I was supposed to play champs tonight, mate. I was just doing that literally because somebody called me out there and it annoyed me. Because for a start, they're called GTA 5 Golf Caddy, which in itself is gash enough. And secondly, they're fucking playing on old gen, mate. And they've actually think that they've got the, the minerals to face me on new gen. And they can't even match with me. So, you know, it's just, it's outrageous. It's like somebody saying, hey, I'll batter you at the new, you know, fucking Zelda game. You can't really batter somebody at Zelda, but you know what I mean. I'll batter you at the new Zelda game, and then they whip out the old fucking Game Boy from 1989, and like, let's play the original fucking Zelda. Hang on a sec. No. We're not. We're supposed to be playing the new Zelda. I don't know about that fucking old school Zelda, mate. You know? Crazy. Shit, no, my crossplay's not off, Jason. <laughs> I literally said to remind me, and then I've just completely forgotten. D-Tex, welcome in, D-Tex. Hello, hello. What's happening, D-Tex? Oof. Oof. Focus up tonight, get the best rewards you can. I respect that. Oh, shit! Yes, he's missed it, he's missed it. Exactly, Andy says pig old gen is like using margarine instead of butter. <laughs> oh, thank you, Moose. Nice one, nice one. Right, let's, uh, let's win the first game of champs this evening, then. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? Let's focus up. Thank you, Jesse. She says, smash them likes up. Thank you, Jesse. Hey, how many likes are we on, guys? Have we smashed 100 yet? Keep hitting the thumbs up so it helps the channel out. It's free. So twat if the like button if you're just joining us. Help us get to 169 likes. We're going to have a pack opening at 169 likes tonight. We've got some raw packs saved up, so hit the old subscribe button. Oh, Dimitar Berbatov! You beast, lad! You beast! Loving this Dimmy card, mate. He's an absolute beast. Oh, Berbatov, lad! It's a pace in two minutes for the lad! Come on, Berber! Let's go, Don Berbatov, sir! Guys, a tank, lad! Two goals to nil in the first game of champs tonight, guys. It's good. Oh, it's real nice. Oh, it's, fi it's filthy. Berbatov hat trick! Oh! Thank you, Matthew Deals Doyle says, good luck, pig. Eleven plus wins this weekend. I'll definitely will get that, mate. Oh, no dramas. I don't think I've I don't think I've have I yeah, no, I'm pretty sure since we changed tactics to these new tactics, I've got eleven wins every single week, haven't I? Like easily. Well, not easily, but we've got eleven wins every single week since changing tactics. Oh, it's a drubination, guys! 
3-0 batterations. Come on. Let's get some goal emojis in there and some Sues. Let's fucking go, everybody. Come on. We're doing this. We're smashing this fall. What a start. What a start to the night stream here. John Holiday, good warm-up game there, mate. That's probably why we started this game so well. Good, good solid game from John Holiday there, mate. You know, give us a nice, nice warm-up. Good preparations. Good preparations for the night stream, lad. Yes, guys, foot like a traction engine. Let's go. Oh. Berber wants his hat-trick here. Berbatov wants his hat-trick here, guys. And there it is. Berbatov hat-trick. Come on. Dimitar. Guys, a tank, lad. Oh, Sully Griffin. Thank you so much, Sully. Come on, you legend. Let's go, Sully Griffin. Five new members. Da -da -da. Sully Griffin's the man. The man handing out channel memberships. Come on, Sully Griffin, my son. Let's be having you. Where are you? Let's go. Sully Griffin, baby. Sully Griffin. Shit. Sully Griffin. Sully Griffin in the chat. In the chat. Sully Griffin going raw in the chat. Sully Griffin. Sully Griffin. Sully Griffin in the chat. In the chat. Thank you so much, Sully, for your generosity, guys. Can we break out some big red panties there for Sully? Five new members. You lucky, lucky people if you just got a free membership there from Sully. He's on side. He's on side. Finish him. Thank you very much there, by the way. Um, Moose says hat trick. Yes, D-Tex, let's go. Hey, what's happening there? Simple free. Welcome in, bro. Yeah, nice one. Thanks for watching the Vertical Live. If you're watching the Vertical Live, give that a thumbs up and a share if you want as well. But yeah, we're also doing a regular normal stream on the channel. If you click my channel, you'll find the regular stream also, guys. Great game today, mate. Yes, it was a good one, wasn't it? Obviously for a nil-nil. Very tight sort of game, tight affair. Respect. Arsenal doing bits. Looks super organised and defending really well, like Burp Aiton. Like. That was good, wasn't it? Oh, you're talking about Liverpool. <laughs> of course, you're talking about Liverpool being a Liverpool scammer, right? Yeah, I didn't watch that one. I didn't watch that one, but you did win. Yeah, fair play to you, lad. Hey, nice one for that, Sonny. This one's for you, boss. This one's for you, boss. Now Liverpool's winning the title. It's given them the sort of the, the you know, the, yeah, the driving, the position in the driving seat, hasn't it, really? Georgie, best shot on goal. You're back, folks. Duke of Rodtown, welcome back in, my son. Hey, get in there, you legend. Tommy Boyle, let's go. He's once, twice, two months a member. And I love you. I love you. How you doing tonight, Tommy Ball? Hashtag two for Tommy. Thank you for being a double member of a legend. Did you watch the fight, dude? Sent you a funny on Twitch. You know what? I didn't, mate. No. I actually didn't. Oh! No, I didn't, mate. Did I miss much then, did I? Get in there, Tommy, my son. Thank you very much for your highlight member coming there, dude. Hope you're having a great evening. By the way, this guy's coming back into this game. This is not good. Storming and battering melters. Yeah, I know. I've just started, sort of took my foot off the gas here, reading the chat out a bit because I was cruising. But, you know, now he's got back in the game. Nah, 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 nah. Good fight, says PJ. So worth watching back, was it? Oh. Jesse talks football. Let's go. She's once, twice. Five months a member. Oh no! And I love you. I love you. Get in there. Hashtag five for Jesse as well. Thank you, Jesse as well. She says, smash them likes up for Piggy, you legend. Get in there. Thank you, Jesse, for showing your support to the channel there, being a member S legend. And also driving up those likes. This one's for you. It's a great ball. Oh. Yeah, nice one. Thank you very much, Jesse. Hashtag five for the legend. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Crunch. Oh, no! Could be a potential red. What? Oh, decent, decent, decent. He's got a horrible chance here, though. Cracking fight, battered each other. Oh, nice. I have to watch it back, lad. I have to watch it back. Top of the league. Happy Easter, everyone. Oh, yeah, shit. Happy Easter, guys. I forgot to say. Happy Easter, guys. Concentrate, Bert. You're slipping. Okay, John Holiday. Yeah, let's concentrate here, lad. Shit, get a player back on the line. Yeah, oh, yes, nice. Okay, come on then, Dimmy. Come on then, Dimmy. Dimmy Tar. Dimmy Tar. Dimmy Tar. Oh. Roddy, the career mode legend. Welcome in, boss. 
Nah, DBR says Piggy, ass collapsing here. Come on, mate, son. Nah, nah, nah. I just took my eyes off the prize for a second there, mate. Now, nah, once I concentrate again, it will be a formality. 94 likes at the moment. Decent, guys. We just need six more for 100. Just need six more. Who's going to be number 100? So I played a, game, a quick game of darts earlier, Tommy, and I just went on to N01. Um, I, lo I lost to some some bloke. Lost to some bloke, but actually did win a leg, though. I'm playing, I was playing a little bit better. It's a tough old game, of darts. I'm still, still learning, still learning. Still learning, but I do love it, though. I do enjoy it. Sometimes get a bit frustrated by it, but, you know, I guess that's like anything. You just want to do better, don't you? Bang! Oh! Easter period going quick as usual. Oh, yeah, it does. Everyone enjoy your day off tomorrow. Who's uh, who's off tomorrow, then? Smash a yes in the chat if you're not working tomorrow. Or smash a working if you are working. But hopefully if you are working, you're getting, like, double time or triple time or something. Time and a half, at least. But, yeah, hope everybody enjoys their Monday off tomorrow. If you do have it off. Simple's got it off. Nice, simple, nice. Yeah, but you're Scouse, so you've got every every day off work, mate. Hey -o! <laughs> I'm joking, man, I'm joking. Hey -o! Hey, Maya, thank you so much for getting in with a highlighted member comment, my son. Come on. Let's go. Come on, dude. He's once, twice, five months a member. And I love you. What? <laughs> hey, nice one, boss. Let's go. Uh, you think we go in a bottle on Thursday? Oh, no, I don't actually, mate. No, I don't. Personally, don't think so. Nah, nah we'll be all right, mate. We'll be all right, lad. Hey, get in there, my son. Thank you, A. Mai, for being a five-month member. Stephen Shipman says yes, Xbox and weed. Go on, my son, man. Let's go. You're working tomorrow, Simon. Exclusive says yes. Nice one, retro gamer. Let's go. Going to a big boot fair with my in-laws. Oh, nice. Tommy says, stance, head still, concentration on arm movement. It will come, dude. Muscle memory. Like exactly. It will come, won't it? Yeah, definitely. Ah, uh, you know, one day I'm going to be like, Phil the Piggy Taylor, dude, you know? Looks wise, anyway. FIFA Presto, what's going on? What's happening there, FIFA Presto? Hope you're doing good. Hey, Presto, it's FIFA Presto. What's happening there, dude? Hope you're having a good night tonight. Oh, no! Shit, guys, shit, shit. We've actually bottled this a little bit now. Right, I do have to lock in. Sorry, I've been nonchalantly reading the chat there. Let's just focus up for a second here, guys. We've given this guy a, back, a way back in. It's actually a proper amateur hour. Nice G-Wolf, you're getting an Xbox this week. Nice G-Wolf, what are you getting? A uh, series, just a Series S or a Series X, what are you getting? But yeah, Series S, that's all I've got, mate. Does the job to a cracking standard. Oh, bury him! You must bury that lad. Shocking. Maldini! Oh! Okay, we need subs. Well, well done, Big Zinedine. Well done, Big Zinedine. No, Big Zinedine. No, Big Zinedine. You shat it, Big Zinedine. No, Coleman, lad. Yes, boys. Nice press in there, boys. Go on, boys. Yes, Georgie, best in space for days. Darwin, Sharpwin, Puna's in there. Shall we cross? No, we won't. We won't. Now we will. That's fucking shite. What a shit shot. Oh, my God. Go on, Georgie. Go on, Georgie. It's all you, Georgie. Georgie, best. Come on. Inside the inside of the post, mate. Let's go. Stoic says this vertical hits death different. Do you prefer the vertical or the landscape, guys? Stoic Savage is liking the vertical at the moment. You've got a trickster place on your team, says Moose. Uh, don't know. <laughs> Do I? Stoic says, not sure how I feel about the piggy close up. Uh, it's, you know, it's, it's pretty. It is close up, I feel you. I think people prefer the landscape in general. Yeah, mine's a Series S, Stuart, just the basic one. Yeah, I've just got a Series S, lad. Oh, shit, we better make subs real quick. I've just got a Series S, mate, so it's just the basic one. But it does the job. does the job for what I need it to, anyway. 
obviously if you play loads of games and you've just got like crazy amounts of storage needs then it's probably not going to do the job but i i don't i only play a few games master god welcome in bro good work thank you master god appreciate that dude by the way if you're new into the stream tonight consider hitting the subscribe button we're on here most nights you might be new there master god i'm not sure but hit the subscribe if you are new get yourself involved give us a follow nice one Solid defending there, my son. Solid defending. Oh, how do you miss that as well? That's obscene. Do you know what? I don't think my subs actually worked there, guys, did they? No, they actually didn't. Shit. Okay, hang on. Let me get these subs changed up because I've had a mare there. I've had an actual mare. Let's get Sour on. Yeah, we'll go with Hoyland up top as well. Go on then. That'll do. Thank you, Shane McCarthy, you legend. Nice, Matthew Doyle. We hit 100 likes. Let's go. Thank you, everyone who smashed the like button here on YouTube there. Oh, shit. April Fool's, Fool's tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, you know, Alpha Hudson. Good question. You Evo Dempsey, now he's raw. Nice, John. When I die online, lady to rest. Oh, yeah, so it's savage. Well done there. 91 Orban, very good. He's good, isn't he, FIFA Presto? I know, he's super cheap and, like, super underrated. I don't know, he's just really good. I wasn't expecting to be as good as that because I picked him up for about 40k. Like, real cheap. It's real cheap for a good card. At all. He's real cheap for a good card. Ben Taylor. Yes, yeah, Sour's base is still saucy. Yes, yeah, she's still good. Hey, Footbury Brownie. What's happening, you Welsh legend? Welcome in. Hello to you, sir. Yeah, I'm not too bad, lad. How are you doing? This game's pish. Think I'll stick to darts. Good shout, William McDonald. Yeah, no, I don't think you, uh, don't think you can handle this, my son. It's a stressful game, this. I would advise people not to play it. Especially if they are, uh, you know, of um, a certain disposition. Like, easily stressed out. I.e. me. Oh, because I get stressed out with this game big time. Shane McCarthy has pig invited you to the darts group yet on Telegram. Yes, I believe I have, right? Pretty sure. Pretty sure I did that ages ago, right? Uh, were you the one who couldn't get in the group? I can't remember now. No, I don't know. Should have done though, man. Yes, should have done. You're too pissed off to play it, right? Yeah, FIFA is stressful. It's not the best game. I can't play it when I'm uh, stressed out. So I know it's just going to stress me out even more. Ooh, guys, he's back in this one. No, I haven't got Prince. She's like 94 rated or something, but nah, I'm not getting that. She's dirt cheap as well. She must be shy. How many controls are broken this year? You're on your fourth. I'm on my second, actually, John. Yeah. <laughs> I did break one a couple of weeks ago. Accidentally, of course. Yeah, no, you might be right, Tommy Ball. I, I seem to remember I, after one stream, I basically sent an invite to everyone who wanted it, but maybe I did miss someone, I don't know. Jody Philander, hello to you, Jody. How have you been, Jody Philander? Great to see you. Long time legend. 98th minute equaliser. Now, I'm just going to shit ass this, guys. <laughs> Look at this. Just shit out this for the last minute of the game. <laughs> Have some of that, mate. Blow the whistle, ref. Get in there, my son. Come on. And we've won. Let's get some big W's in there, my friends. Huge dubs. Huge dubs. Huge dubs. Huge dubs. Huge dubs. Hola. Hola, Senor Dubbington. Hasta luego, Senor Dubbington. Mi casa su casa. <laughs> Tommy Ball says that's just evil. Oh, man. Something so satisfying about doing that. <laughs> nice one. Get in there, Moose. We got the W anyway, mate. Yes, thank you, Moose, for the W. Thank you, John Holiday, for the W. Oh, no. What? That's awful, Jody Fernandez. I'm so sorry to hear you guys. Can we get some love hearts in there? Some uh, rest in pieces for Jody's dog, Nero. Dude, that's awful. Somebody poisoned him. Fucking hell, man. Some bastards in the world, mate. Sorry to hear that, dude. Crikey, man. Let's get some big love in there for Jody's dog there, Nero. Christ. Great name for a dog, by the way. Great name.
<sighs> Thank you, FIFA, Presto, and Lincoln plays. Crikey, Lincoln, maybe you should see a doctor about that, my son. Bloody hell. Crikey, crikey, Lincoln. <clears throat> see a doctor, my lad. Right, on to the next one. So we are 1-0. and That's a good start. It's a good start. Uh, Andy says, Pig, it's not that 94 Prince is shite per se. It's more that she's so common. Oh, fair enough then. Well, yeah, I mean, look, her stats look insane. I looked at the card. It looked insane. It looked insane. Like an awesome card, you know. Um, but it's so cheap, it just puts me off. But, you know, how can it be that bad when it's got so many awesome high-rated attributes, you know? How could it be that bad? <clears throat> On to the next, guys. On to the next. Fault the start so far. Let's make it 2-0. Oh. I'm on 20-0 oh right now, Owen. Yes, sir. 20-0 oh incoming. What a community here, by the way. Look at all these legends. Wishing you well there, Mr. Jody Fernando. Such a bunch of legends in this community. Big up the Bacon Brigade. Really, Outlaw Tom, uh, Prince has the fish taco play style. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> oh, dude. Tron Holiday says, well, happy with my Jolona, but always they weigh, they release a sick one just as soon as complete the SBC. Oh, who's that you, you uh, that they released that now you completed that you would rather would have got? Who are you talking about there? But yeah, nice one, John Holiday. That's uh, That Jolona card does look sick. Hey, Moose, don't worry. He says, love you. Sorry, i got to go. I love your work. Thank you very much, Moose, for watching. You have a great day at work, boss. Appreciate you joining the Bacon Express today, lad. Choo-choo! Choo-choo! Next stop, Moose Workville. That's, uh, yes, please do depart the, uh, the, 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 the carriage. Nice one, Moose. Appreciate you. Oh, shit. Great save, that one. Great save. Great save. G will says, Pigo ain't never getting 20 0. Well, I've got more chance of getting 20 than 20 0 than you have got of even qualifying for that kind of thing. To be honest with you, do you know what I mean? G will flag, to be honest, brutally, brutally honest with you. I've got more chance of getting 20 than 0 than you've got getting 4 0 in fucking qualies, mate. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> and you know that's true. Oh. I could probably beat G with 20 nils as I've had said. I mean, that's a bit harsh, lad, but over two legs, definitely. <laughs> definitely, if it wasn't a 20 goal deficit, deficit in two games, I would be uh, annoyed about that. <laughs> but over one game, I don't know, 20 is asking a bit too much. But two games, definitely. Well, there you go, G-Wolf. You might be shy to the game, but obviously you enjoy it. That's the most important thing. No way, that was good. Hello, Callum Morris. You packed 94 Cafu today, Matthew Doyle. Banging, lads. Get some big dubs in there for Matthew Doyle. That's a sick ball, lad. Well done. Ooh, big header from distance there. Simon Lee getting in here from the Welsh Valleys. What's going on there, Simon? But thank you so much for getting in here, my son. Boy, oh. Oh, here he is. Zane Miassi, lad. Zane Miassi. Zane Miassi. Zane Miassi in the chat. In the chat. Super, super chat. Super Zane Miassi. Hey, nice one, Zane Miassi. How you doing? I bet you're feeling reasonably content with that result and performance earlier. It was very... Uh, What's the word? Organised and well defended and stuff by the Arsenal Hollands in a good game. 
so from you. So, yeah, fair play to you, mate. Uh, makes things interesting, keeps things interesting. At least City scummers aren't top, but it has, does mean that those Liverpool wank bags have gone top. It's a disgrace and a nonsense. Let's get some Sue's in there for Zane. How are you doing today there, Zane? Oh, no! Oh, shit, it's a red card, mate. He's getting sent. I'm sure he won the ball there. I know it was, like, man first, I guess. Ref, steady on, ref, steady on, ref. Oh, fuck off, ref. Fuck right off, ref. That's unreal. Ugh. Guys, what's happened here? Right, we're going to have to take Sharp when Puna's off. Sharp when Puna's is coming off. Do I have a defender? I don't even have a defender. We're going to have to put Batcher there at left back. Matson over there, but that's not ideal. Oh, no. You like the Francis Scoli card? I've seen that. A lot of people smashing smashing me up with him, actually, bro. Yeah, good one. Natalia Zamina, welcome in. How you doing? Al Camo. Uh, yeah, I have played it, but back in the day. Not this year. Not this year. I've shat it, guys. What have I done? I've actually had a complete day, man. Hopefully we can save this pen. But otherwise, we've got ten men here. Ten men. By the way, can we get a hashtag Welcher in there for Zay Miassi, please, guys? <laughs> Let's get a hashtag Welcher bastard. In the live chat. Oh, no. He smashed it in top pins as well. 109 likes. Nice, guys. We need 60 more for a... Uh, 60 more for a... Um, for a pack opening, guys. Zane Miyassi, lad. Thank you very much, bro. Oh, super, super chat. Super Zane Miyassi. That's installment four of many, by the looks of it. <laughs> Zane Miyassi, we've set up an installment plan, are we, mate? Right, I see. <laughs> Zane Miyassi says, one of your best meltdowns, Piggy, yesterday. Was it? Not really, mate. Not really, was it? Wasn't really, was it, mate? Oh! Wasn't really, was it, mate? No. Talking guff there, Zay Miassi, my son. But fair play to you. Thank you for the nice comment, though, mate. Appreciate you. I mean, it was certainly a big meltdown from United there, having four or 96 minutes to get a goal, only to absolutely shart it straight away. It's absolutely pathetic, wasn't it? Yes, get in there. No! No! I don't believe this. He's melted. Melted with the finish in front of goal there. G Wolf United. Oh! He's once, twice, 12 months a double member. And I love you. I love you. G Wolf's demand. Thank you so much for supporting the channels, mate. You're a long time, long schlong don of these uh, parts. Ooh! Thank you very much. I can't believe, yeah, one year already on the gaming channel as well. How many on the main channel, lad? Fucking years. One of the OGs, Mr. G-Wolf. Let's get some wolf head emojis in the live chat and some hashtag. Oh! For G-Wolf there, guys, please. Thank you, the Wolfster, for, for being here, mate. Appreciate you, dude. Absolute edge. Yeah, Sub2 says a bet's a better man keeps his word than the Western days you should be shot for lying. <laughs> Jonathan Gallagher! How are you tonight, Jonathan? Yeah, PayPal links in the description, Zane. Can we get a hashtag PayPal links in the description, Zane? <laughs> Let's go. Oh, man. I'm joking, I'm joking. Zane is a big support of this channel, but I don't know why he makes these bets if he's just going to be a welcome investor. There's no point. No point listening to this guy, is it? <laughs> Get in there, Georgie. Oh, what? He's going to rage quit 1-1 one, one when he's got ten. When I've got 10 men. Is he a complete pussyhole, this guy? He must be. Or he's going to change something tactically. I think he's just quitting, though. Simon Lee, you're watching the vertical live, Simon. Click on my channel, click on live, and then you'll see the other stream. So we're streaming both vertically and horizontally at the moment, mate. So you want to go and check out the horizontal live, mate. This is the vertical that you're in right now. And then that will uh, sort everything out. Also, everybody subscribe. We're only three subscribers away from 5,200, our next mini milestone. We're only three subscribers away, so everyone hit that subscribe button. No! Oh, fuck. He's done me, guys. I just wasn't really paying attention properly there. Nice one, John Holiday. Thank you, although we shat it now. Conti Kev getting in there raw. Legend, absolute legend. Referee! It's a disgrace, man. We can get the win. We have got 10 men, though, remember, dude. Oh, thank you, G-Wolf. Yeah, same with you, buddy. Much love to you, dude. 
This one's for you, GG Wolf. Get in there, the Wolfster! Dimitar! Dimitar Berbatov! Thank you, Stone Cold Steve Austin, says I asked my buddy Vince to subscribe. Yeah, please do there. Please do there. Hell yeah. Give me a hell yeah. This is the version where you see pig's nose hairs. I'm actually quite blessed in that department. You know, I don't really have too much in the nose hair department. I'm being obviously subtle. But some people have got fucking forest something they need to trim them and stuff. I haven't got there yet. Maybe in a few years' time. I always remember my dad having, like, real hairy nose and hairy ears and stuff. Uh, when he was, like, 50. So I can imagine it's coming. But I haven't got that yet. I haven't got hairy ears or a hairy nose just yet. Fabio Minetti, happy Easter to you, boss. Yes, mate. Super Burber, I know. Guy's a beast on this game for me, man. Guy's a beast. The Arsenal game was not all that great. Well, it was very good from Arsenal's perspective. Jason going away to City and defending really resolutely and, you know, not losing. Thank you, John Holiday. Let's go. Ray Nose says that's when you know you're old. Yeah, happy England Easter. Happy Monday. Thank you very much, beat Fabio, bro. Buongiorno to you, sir. Can we beat him with 10, 10 men, guys? Hashtag I believe in the chat if you think we can. Can we beat him with 10 men? Yeah, Berber, that new 93 version is insane, Wallstrom. I'm very much loving it. Great card. I mean, I don't know how much I've lost on him. I bought him for 340k. Anybody know what he's going for now on Xbox? Probably like 100k less than that. I don't know. But, uh, you know, I just bought him straight away because I just really wanted him and my teammates to check him out. And he does not disappoint. The guy's sick. Look at that movement from Dimitar. Look at this movement from Dimitar. Oh, Dimitar. Oh. Oh no, just got the run, run wrong there. Okay, he's paused it. Don't know why he's paused it, but he's paused it. Is he making subs that earlier? Is he just quitting? Nice one, the hoop man. 113 likes, 195 watching, keeping the likes. Thank you guys. 113 likes with 195 watching. You what? I'm fucking leaving! Baker Brigade, assemble! We can do better than that, my friends. Twat that thumbs up. Oh, yes. You about tomorrow, Sausage, for some offline darts and chat. Had a light bulb moment once I run by you. Yeah, Tommy, mate. I should be, dude, at some point. Yeah, I should be at some point. Absolutely. Probably not until the afternoon slash early evening, though, knowing my body clock. But, yeah, at some point. This one. Oh, get in there. No way. What? We just scored from an indirect, from an indirect free kick. What a ball into the box there, mate. Like, we just scored from a set piece, crossing a balling and heading it. What? That's like the second goal in FC24 I've ever scored like that, mate. <laughs> yes, mate. Come on. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. Rage. Rage quit. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. Rage. Rage, quit. Mate, we've got the job done. Nice one, FIFA Presto. Nice one, Rajat. Thank you, Outlaw Torn. Buttered sausages and darts with pig and friends. <laughs> What's the idea then, Tommy Ball, lad? Anyway, no need to be so secret, lad. You can tell us. Run it by the chat, mate. Run it by the chat. See what they say. 93 Berbatov is in 151k now. Insane. Are you joking me, Andy? Are you fucking joking me, Andy? You're telling me I've lost 200k overnight, bro. Are you joking me, Andy? No way, Andy! I bought him for 340, lad! No way, Andy, lad! What? Oh, that's awful. That's absolutely awful, dude. Oh, shit, crossplay. Yeah, let's turn that off. I forgot. Zane Miassi with another super chat says, Saliba Gabriel, best, I think, in yes or not? Your best centre-backs in the league, yes or no? They were great today. Um, best in the league. Best centre-backs in the league. Uh... I mean, as a pairing, as a duo, I mean, what's the other options, really? You've got, like, you know, Aki and fucking Diaz or whatever. Or Gavardio, sorry. Gavardio at City with Aki today, weren't it? And then you've got 
Martinez and Varane, which doesn't really come close right now, basically. Liverpool's centre-backs, Gomez and Van Dijk's pretty decent, I guess. Uh, yeah, um, I'm going to say no. I'm going to say it's not the best in the league, but it is up there. You've got to say it is up there, but it's not the best in the league, no. Yeah, Stones and Diaz maybe sub two. I don't know. Van Dijk. Van Dijk. Uh, Van Dijk's in there, probably, you know. So, yeah, I don't know about that. Definitely, I'd say Saliba could be in with a shout, though, as being in the, you know, in like the team, you know. Yeah, nah, mate. Right, hey, we got the win there, guys. But how rare is that that you actually score from a free kick like that with a cross in? Connor Tompkins, thank you very much for getting in here and subscribing, Connor Tompkins. Nice one, Connor. Mate, that means we must be really close now to 5,200 subs. We're on 5,200, guys. Sue, come on, get in there, my son. 5.2K subs on the gaming channel, lads. Creeping up there, creeping up there. Let's get 5.2K in the, in the chat there. We've hit the next mini milestone there, guys. That's lovely. Cheers, everyone, for hitting the sub up there. Good stuff, good stuff. Nice one, Connor Tompkins. Nice one, Connor Tompkins. Okay, nice one, Jason Chapman. Sweet. Are you sorry? Sorry, you're in. Yeah, you. Yeah, you're in the group, aren't you, mate? Yeah, you're in the group, right? You're in the group. Who who are we trying to get in the group? Shane McCarthy. Shane McCarthy's the Omen, right? The Omen is his name on there. Is that right? Yeah, who we were playing. I can't remember if he's in the darts group or not. I don't think he is, is he? Zay Miyassi, thanks for the super chat, bro. Super super chat, super Zay Miyassi. Sub two, we are winning the league. Rise of Mikel. Mm, I still doubt it, but I really hope you're right, but I still doubt it. Guys, who wins the league? Arsenal, Liverpool or City? Who wins the league? Let us know. Sadly, and I, you know, they're not looking fantastic. I, I'm going to say City. I still think City win the league. There you go. They've just been there and done it many times. So I think they'll, they'll, they'll see the league. They'll, they'll leave it there. But let's see what you guys are saying. Same as he reckons Arsenal Holland. I doubt it. Outlaw Taunts is Liverpool. Oh, shit! Oh, what a wank time to change your fucking tactics, guys. I wasn't ready. This dickhead. Man. You got Berber out of an 85 prospect. That's amazing, though, Wolves. Yeah, what a pull. Love that. Oh, shit. No, we just gifted this guy two pigging goals here, pretty much. No way. Oh, come on, you fucking big fucking camel. I'm loving riding bastard. Oh, my God. How has that happened? Oh. 2-0 drubbing. Get on side, George! Crossplay off. Shit, Amy, I forgot again. Guys, you're going to have to remind me before I go into the game. Oh, Shane McCarthy. Okay, mate. Sorry about that. Let me send you the link in a minute there before I forget. Nice one, mate. Are you sure I didn't send you the link? I'm almost sure I did. But <laughs> well, I must have done. Okay. No way, I tried to skim with it, it just didn't work. Oh, come on, referee. Don't you be brandishing yellows for that, lad. There's my Insta. Oh, it's just, I think it's exclamation mark Insta, actually. I think I was just trying to be cool. <laughs> Stanway Fantasy absolutely cracked. Should try her out already, Connor. Thanks for the tip, bro. Get in there, Zane. I see another super chat from Zane. Says United beat Liverpool, helps us win the league. Well, yeah, that's what you want, isn't it? Exactly. Help me win the league. You need some help, don't you? Definitely. Definitely. Well, <laughs> you, you can hope, mate. You can hope. After that result the other day in the FA Cup, anything can happen. Especially in that sort of full run of game, eh? It's an old Trafford as well, says sub two. Yeah, nice. Not that that really means all that much. We play shite at old Trafford a lot of the time these days, don't we? But it used to be a fortress, not so much anymore. Obviously, no. Come on, it's 3-0 to this Arsenal twat, guys. We've got battered here. Zane Miassi. Why is he pausing it for you, prick? I can't stand these pausing pricks, man. Fuck you. No, I'm not quitting at 3-0, you rat. Zane says, what film Cameron make after Avatar, Piggy? What film will he make? I, I hope he makes another Terminator movie, though. That'd be sick. And just undoes all of the shit films they made after T2, basically. It would be nice. 
because I love the Terminator movie, me, but let's face it, all of the ones after Judgment Day are a bit shit. Look, Terminator 3 is okay. Terminator, Sal Terminator Salvation kind of banging out for me. Uh, I'll be honest, it's not got Arnie in, it's not got any of the usual customers in, or Christian Bale and some other random melt. But it's actually really decent. Actually. Salvation's decent, and then the other two are fucking terrible. Genesis is awful. And if that wasn't bad enough, that Dark Fate is the worst movie I've ever seen in my life. It might, it might actually be the worst movie I've ever seen in my life. Dark Fate was fucking awful. Worst film I've ever seen. So, yeah, I would, I would like Cameron to make another Terminator movie, mate, and do a proper job of it. Oh, good one, Tommy. Tommy says Abyss 2. The Abyss 2. Yeah. Nice one. The Abyss 2. True Lies 2 would be a banger as well. True Lies 2. Yeah, man. Oh, come on now. Right, one back before half time at least. You never know. Go on then, Berbatov. Go on then, my son. Shout when Punis is, is away there. Berbatov. Berber. Ah! We better batter this Arsenal track for his pure truculence. Already know this guy's a tough piece. Because he's an Arsenal track. And the way he paused it there, you know, he's a jeb end. But let's batter him. Oh, no way! He's moved his keeper the right way and I've shat it. Right, okay, next time we'll be more composed. Know that he's a keeper mover. Right, we should have scored right there. No way! Penalty, yes, mate. Come on, send him as well. Send him. Ah. Oh. Connor Tompkins says I was five, one and five yesterday. Changed formation of four, four, one, one. Port Stanway rallied to nine and five. That's fantastic, mate. Well done, dude. That's his nine and fantastic, yeah. Let's go back in the game, guys. Come on. Yeah, exactly. Can't believe the abyss story didn't get seen because it's so good. Yeah, true. This is a good film, that one. Total Recall two. <laughs> Say me assy. Say me assy, you've shat it for me there, bro. That's real good. Say me assy says, do a poll next film, Alien or Terminator Titanic 2. Titanic 2, they've already. I saw there's a Titanic 2 that's just come out on uh, Amazon Prime. Did you see that? It looks fucking awful, mate. How can you. Yes, get in there, my son. Come on. Have some of that, Arsenal scummer. We're back. 3 2, we're back in the game. Come on. Um, I'm not doing that poll, Zane. I'll just ask the chat. What would you prefer, guys? Uh, Alien, Terminator, or Titanic uh, sequel? What would you prefer? Let's, uh, let's ask the chat. But me, personally, out of them, it would be a Terminator one. Although, you know, great. Any of them would be decent, apart from Titanic 2. That sounds like an abomination to mankind. Titanic 2's Man United. <laughs> oh, guys, we're nearly back in there. Terminators of Steven, Titanic 2. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Oh my god, what a save by his keeper. We're smack bang in this game. You know this guy's going to quit at 3-3 though. I can feel it. I've just got a feeling he's the type of twat that if we fight back to win 3-3 here, he's just going to quit. Oh, guys, come on. It's all one-way traffic here. We're battering him. Titanic 2, Leo comes back to life as a zombie, frozen for years, then he wakes up and starts the apocalypse. <laughs> Love that sub too. Good shout. Planet of the Apes. <laughs> like Spike. Thank you, Kim. How are you doing tonight, Kim? Yes, please do hit the thumbs up button if you haven't done so, everybody. Hit the like spike on the video. That's funny. Uh, Titanic 2 underwater. That's film, film over. <laughs> yeah, no, there's a legit Titanic 2 hoop man on Prime right now. I saw it the other day, man. I watched the trailer for it. Just popped up. It looks truly as bad as you could possibly imagine. It looks fucking awful, lad. Titanic, one of my favourite movies. Says Outlaw Torn. It's a good movie, Titanic. It's decent, lad. It's decent. Decent. You have not seen Titanic 2 at the moment. Now, nah, don't watch it, man. Don't watch it. It'll be absolutely terrible, mate. What? How could they remake it? It's just going to be a rehash of the first one, literally. That's the only way you can make Titanic 2. It's just a repeat exactly what happened in the first one. What's the fucking point of that? <clears throat> T 
Terminator starring Sydney Sweeney and Stone Cold Steve Austin. <laughs> Wait, that Sydney Sweeney's everywhere at the moment. Wherever you turn, all you hear is Sydney Sweeney. She's definitely in favour of the month at the moment, isn't she? Never even heard of her up until about two months ago. I'll tell you what, though, great set of assets on her. <laughs> Same here, Ashley. Thank you for the 199 super chat, mate. Super, super chat, super Zayme Yasty. Zayme Yasty's going ham at the hat. Guys, get some ham emojis in the live chat there for Zane, some super chat emojis. He's going ham out here, guys. He's making it rain, to be fair. Sorry, Bloody Well should do after losing a £50 bet, mate. You're a disgrace, Dane. That's instalment number seven. Titanic 2, the iceberg strikes back. <laughs> get in there, Tommy lad, yes. Oh, Titanic meets ghost ship. Uh, exclusive, just, uh, just got yourself a dartboard. I know this is a dumb question. What is the best way to attach it to a wall? Just screws. Okay, exclusive. So you need to buy like a little mounting kit. It's literally like this little, yeah, you basically just put three screws in the back and then like this little plastic circular thing in the middle, which then connects onto another bit that's on the wall and they just slot it on basically. A mounting kit. Get a dartboard mounting kit. You could probably get one for like 99p or something. If not, then... Uh, Tommy, what's a good way he can improvise? But I would, um, I would I would suggest you've got to get the proper little, you know, you basically just screw, yeah, you basically just screw a screw into the wall and then you just screw a little bracket to the back of your dartboard, a tiny little square thing that just slots onto your screw, basically. That's all it is. Literally 99p jobby, I reckon. But um, maybe there's another way of doing it, though. Quality, though. Quality that you got that. Quality that you got that exclusive, mate. Come on, you've grabbed a dartboard. That's beautiful. Which one did you get in the end? Came with one, didn't realise that was what it was for. Oh, brilliant exclusive. Yeah, nice one, mate. Yeah, it's come with one, dude. Yeah, nice one. There you go. So, yeah, they, that's good. That's awesome, man. Hey, Berber, welcome in the stream, mate. How you doing, lad? Hello to everybody but the pig. Screw you, Don Berber, lad. You know what I mean? <laughs> How you doing, though, anyway? Hello to you, even though you didn't say hello to me, lad. Jordan Profi, what's good, mate? Hello to you, Jordan. Thanks for saying hi to me, Jordan. <laughs> Oh, another another super chat, is it? Oh, yeah. Zay Miassi, thank you for your super chat here, my friend. Let's get some Sues in the live chat there, please, for Mr. Zay Miassi, bro. Go on, lad. Go on. Zay Miassi, Zay Miassi, Zay Miassi, talking shite, talking shite. Zay Miassi's talking shite. Guys, have you seen it's 3-3, by the way? I don't know if you've seen it's 3-3, but we're going to win this pigging game after 3-0 down, after being 3-0 down. We're going to win this shit. Let's keep our wits about us here, man. Full-on concentration mode. Let's get a hashtag I believe in there as well. We were 3-0 down in this one against this Arsenal's twat. What spurred me on is he paused it at 3-0 and really pissed me off. Oh, and I don't like it when people pause it when I tell you to go. I don't like it, especially not a 3-0. I don't like it. Nice one for that, Zane. Appreciate you, dude. It was called a hot shot board, I think. 45 quid off Amazon. Okay, nice, mate. Beautiful, lad. Good stuff. Decent, decent. That's good. Yeah, you want to get yourself some decent arrows as well. And uh, yeah, you'll be good to go. Yeah, it's good fun, absolutely. Yes, exclusive. I'll add you to the darts group exclusive so you can get some offline games on the go against some members of the BB here, lad. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah, I'll do that, I'll do that. I'll do that, lad, I'll do that. Um, Nice one. No. No! Fucking bastard hole! Oh. We've shat the bed there, guys. We've absolutely full on shat it. Remember the gritty on him back, mate. I know, Matthew. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. But we've just generally shat it there, my son. Oh, no. Dudes. Damn it, man. After coming back from 3-0 down, we've got to get this job done. Come on. Zay Miassi, hello Zay Miassi for another one. <laughs> Who would Duke of Rodtown play in Titanic? <laughs> Who would Duke of Rodtown play? Bang! Oh, Duke of Rodtown, I think, personally, he would probably play, having not really met him or spoken to him or know him at all. I personally think he would play. I'm going to say. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm going to say 
I'm going to say Billy Zane's character, mate. You know, that shit house. <laughs> that Billy Zane shit house character, mate. You know, what's his name in it, mate? Forget the actual character thing. You know, that fucking twat. Billy Zane, you know, the one who's with Kate Winslet at the start. And then he fucking, you know. Yeah, that guy. <laughs> Duke of Rodtown could be Billy Zane, mate. How's that? How you like that? <laughs> Cal, that's it. Cal. Cal, yes. Cal, that twat. <laughs> you can be Cal. That's who you can be, mate. All right, Duke of Rodtown. Do you know who Zane Miassi is? I'll tell you who Zane Miassi is, right? Zane Miassi is Jacob Astor. Who's the guy who, uh, the richest guy in, on the ship, who went down with the ship. That's who Zane Miassi is, mate. He's fucking Jacob Astor, lad. You know what I mean? That rich twat. Uh, anyone recommend a good horror? Yeah, I would recommend watching, uh, checking out Zane Miassi's YouTube channel, mate. John Jacob Astor. That's the one, sorry, not Jacob Astor. John Jacob Astor. Yeah, that's the one. You know, I was on personal terms with so I called him Jakey, baby. But, you yeah, know, no, sorry, that's actually quite disrespectful. Sorry, Jacob Astor. No. But, oh, fucking hell! There's an extendable tripod speaker stand on eBay that's where you could attach a block of wood to top it up and mount board too, because actual dark board stands like... That's actually really awesome, Tommy. See, I was thinking about... I've got a, uh, like a, um, a softbox lighting stand tripod, and I was thinking it would be very easy, really, quite easy, to just convert it into a dark board. I might have to get, like, a sandbag just to make sure it doesn't fall over. But, yeah, like, you could easily convert, like, a softbox lighting kit tripod into a dark board. So I was looking at that the other day thinking, that, that can't be that hard to change, you know? Can't be that hard. Oh, shit, hang on. I don't know if that even worked. Ronnie Dodge, thank you for the super chat, boss. Glad Mount got his goal. Shame team let him down. Yeah, that was disgusting, wasn't it, Ronnie? No. That super, super chat, super Ronnie Dodge, bro. That was pretty gash, I know. It would have been a fantastic moment for them. Obviously, it was a good moment for him anyway, getting his first United goal. But it really would have been a tremendous moment if it was the winner and got us the three points. And it should have done. It really should have done. But you're right, his teammates let him down there at the end. Gash, lad. Absolutely gash. Gutted for him. Gutted for us. Gutted for him. Yeah, would have been good. Let's do this, lad. Come on, we can do this. Yeah, I know, I know. Sort of just petered out here, haven't I? Go on then. Go on then, Georgie Best. Who remembers the job song, thinking of it today? What's that one, Captain? <laughs> I don't remember that at all. The job song? What's that all about, bro? The job song. Yeah, oh, legend, Tommy. Yeah, definitely, dude. I put all the info in the Telegram group and video. So much for the next to Dark Water. Oh, brilliant, lad. Exactly the same thing. Yeah, exactly. That's what I sort of thought. I mean, I can't really show you at the moment, but I've just got one in the corner here. And it's just not even in use. Just a softbox lighting kit, you know. It's quite big at the top. You could just basically just fit a board there and put the Dark Water on. Or even just, I don't know, somehow attach the Dark Water inside, like, the housing. Because there's, like, a, a Dark Water-sized rectangle where the light kit is, you know, where the box is, from the soft box, from the soft kit, whatever the fuck it's called. And, uh, yeah, it's decent. Oh, yeah, shit, I need to turn crossplay off, guys. I know, I know, I know. What a nightmare. Oh, I've lost this game, haven't I? Now I haven't, actually. Ten, ten minutes left. Beats Guy, hello, Beats Guy, says, I use pieces of cardboard and duct tape to level my bike. I'm not going to buy a level kit until I get new board. Hey, fair play to you, though. Yeah, you know, just going in there, raw early doors. Yeah, your setup's nice, Alex, mate. I've moved it to your bedroom. That looks sick. Decent. Decent. Yeah, nice. You'll set up tomorrow, get some practice in. Uh, oh, no worries. Uh, do, you, do you not have Telegram anymore, exclusive lad? Because um, there's a little Telegram darts group that we set up. Little Telegram darts group, mate. Worth being in there just so you can get games sometimes, baby. Fuck it, hell, guys. I don't believe this shite. Oh, my God. Oh, we've bloody lost to this Arsenal scummer. We came back. We were free free. How's that even happened, man? Right, back in a minute, guys. Fuck this game. I'll be back in a second. 
Just need a one minute break. Right, everyone, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, get yourself in there raw. And I'll be right back, my friends. Don't go anywhere, my son. Back guys, I've got my cherry cherry coke zero. What's everyone's poison of choice tonight, drinks wise guys? What are you supping down on? Let me know. I'm on the cherry coke zero, my friends. Just to keep you informed of my uh, hydration habits here. That's what I'm drinking on. Crossplay on. Yes, let me sort that out, John. Thank you for reminding me. Hey, OH, boo, boo, boo. You've been hit by, you've been struck by a smooth criminal. Annie, are you okay? Would you tell us if you're okay, Annie? Annie, would you tell us if you're okay? Are you okay, Annie? Annie, are you okay? Annie, are you okay? 
Are you okay, Yanni? Yanni, are you okay? Yanni, are you okay? Are you okay, Yanni? Yep. Nice one. Look, what a tune. Hey, um, thank you, FIFA Presto. You're on the water, are you? Well, let's just see what people are on. Diet Coke. Nice. Oasis. Oh, lovely. Bit of Oasis. Anybody remember that scene back in the day from... Uh, give it a bit of a reference for English people here. Uh, you might not know this if you're not from England, but... Remember Kevin and Perry, mate? Remember, uh... <laughs> remember Harry Enfield and Chums? What a programme back in the day that was. They need to re-bring that back, mate. Harry Enfield and Chums. But anyway... There was an episode where Perry went off to Manchester <laughs> and he uh, comes back and he's drinking a bottle of Oasis. He's been in Manchester for like a week or something. He's like, hey up, hey up there, Kevin, what's going on, mate? How you doing? He comes back to the proper man Caxon. Hey up, mate. Oh, how's it going, mate? And then <laughs> Kevin starts speaking like it. Anyway, it's just fucking classic, mate. I love it. I love, I loved it. Yes, Berber, mate. Harry Enfield was the shit, wasn't it? Absolute the shit. Loved it. Magnus, oh, love you. You're on the Magnus. I ice cold Moretti, nice. Oh, red stripe, cheeky Jamaican bevy lad. I like a red stripe, a white monster, decent. Thank you, Mike, very much there, Mike, for liking and sharing the stream. Keep hit, hitting the like button, everybody, if you haven't. Um, Chris says cherry coke. Oh my god, don't know what's worse, your your taste, or your skills. Wait, what's wrong with cherry? By the way, regular cherry coke is the most elite drink of all time. Like the regular sugary cherry coke. That's the best. I'm on the diet, Choco. It's, it's not good, but it's still decent. No. Nice, Roddy. You're on the ginger beer. I haven't had that in a long time. It's good shit. You got the gym tomorrow. No drink for you. Respect. Oh, no. I didn't turn cross. <laughs> shit. Mad for it. That's it, Berberland. Mad for it, our kid. That's right, our kid. Mad for it, our kid. <laughs> Best show, mate. That's good. You got Corona tonight. Oh, no. Oh, Corona the beer, right, yeah. That's good, then. I like a cheeky Corona and lime, mate. A little piece of lime in the top. Sets it off nicely. Corona. Corona and lime. It's a nice beverage, mate. Hey, we got a super chat from Triple R, lad. Super, super chat. Super, super chat. Super, super chat. It's super Triple R, lad. Let's go. Thank you, RRR, for the £5 super chat. It says, Pig, I'm still feeling about yesterday's performance. Fucking awful, mate. Worst I've seen us play basically all season. There's maybe like five performances that bad. A lot of bad performances this season. But that was right up there, mate. Even though we didn't lose, that was right up there. Fucking awful play from us throughout the whole game. Literally, Brentford had 30-plus shots, mate. We opened the door for them and left it open. It was awful. Hey, hey, get in there, by the way, RRR, lad. Oh, hang on a second. I can, Duke of Rodtown, give me a moment, mate. I'm going to have to scroll and I can't because I'm playing this game. Give me one moment, I'll read it. But, by the way, get some Super Chat emotes in there for RRR. Thank you, RRR, boss. No. Ooh! Duke of Rodtown. What did you say, mate? Sorry, can you put it in there again, maybe? I, then I'll see it more likely. Hang on. It's, oh. Nice one, RRR, my friend. Yeah, I can't scroll at the moment there. Um, you, actually, hang on. Ah, shit, the game's back a little bit. Uh, you would play the role of Wallace Henry Hartley. Oh, yeah. Who was the Titanic Orchestra's bandmaster, right? Yeah, the old famous story of the of the band playing on as the ship, ship sunk. Is that legit? I believe that is legit, mate. I mean, I don't know. But... That is pretty sick, mate. Those guys were just proper G's in the movie, mate. Anyway, if, they, if that... Get in there, Berbatov! What a goal! Hey, Solskjaer 99, what's happening? Wayne and Wayne at a slob. Yes, lad. You know it. Wayne and Wayne at a slob. Oh, man. They couldn't get away with that stuff that they did in that show back in the day. I remember one episode where, like... <laughs> it's ridiculous. They just couldn't do it these days. There's one episode of Harry Enfield and Chunk where Wayne and Wayne at a slob, like, break up. And like, also, I can't remember why they break up now. Get in there, George Best. No. But basically, Wayne Letterstock wants a brown baby. She wants a brown baby like all the other mums on the estate. <laughs> Do you remember that? Oh, what the fuck? They just couldn't. How can they get away with that? And then Wayne goes off and he like shacks up with this like hot Naomi Campbell looking bird. And he comes back and she's like, oh, I've had eight kids, by the way. Do you want one? And then they're like, yeah. And then she's like, oh, thank you, Wayne, for getting me a brown baby. <laughs> That's fucked up. How could they get away? <laughs> Just couldn't get away with that these days, could you? Who remembers that guy? 
Harry Enfield and Chums, man. Old school. That's old school, that. Could get away with that these days. Dude, it, was near, it wasn't actually Naomi Campbell, mate, no. But she was basically playing Naomi Campbell, like, wasn't she? She was called Naomi, I think. But she wasn't actually Naomi Campbell, though, mate. But it did look like her, anyway. <laughs> you sure it was? It, it actually wasn't. It actually wasn't, but it was just somebody who looked a lot like Naomi Campbell, yeah. Like some hot tamale lady, I forget, I don't know, but it wasn't actually Naomi. It wasn't actually Naomi Campbell, mate. I have seen that Harry and Paul one. Yeah, that was good too, mate. That was good too. There's some great scenes in that one also, yeah. Are they bringing back Little Bitten? Dude, how can they even bring that back? There's too many, yeah, like, surely that would just rile everyone up, mate, big time. Surely that would not be, that would not fly in this day and age. Same with that Harry Enfield, just couldn't, certain things you just, well, they have to, oh, come on! Unbelievable. Orange Tango, very nice. Big Train was arguably my, my favorite. Big Train, I'm not sure if I've seen that. Before. Big Train. Is that like a sketch show, is it? Oh, what a finish by Sharpwin Punez. Go on, lad. South Park still get away with it. Yeah, fair enough, mate. South Park do say some. I mean, South Park's super close to the boat. I mean, I remember they had like a, you know, like, um, it's not just anyway, there's like loads of racial stuff going on in South Park all the time, mate. OG! OG, guys, come on! OG, guys, let's get a hashtag OG in there! He shat it! He's absolutely shat it! Oh, Simon Pegg was in Big Train. Wow, really, mate, nice. I remember watching, um, shit, what's that program back in the day? Spaced. That was good, with uh, Nick Frost and Simon Pegg. Remember that guy, Spaced? That's an underrated banger. Not a lot of people have seen that, for some reason, but it's actually pretty good. It was like, you know, before Shaun of the Dead and all, all that sort of stuff, way before. Really decent, decent, though, quite decent. Ooh. Solskjaer says, no wanking in this workplace. Staring competition, World Championship. Can't tell you what. <laughs> nice one, Natalia. Oh, geez, they get getting there. Oh, yeah, Tommy Paul, that's it. The gold toilet in the living room when Wayne won the lottery. Looking at Booking on a Wayne net on the pod, says to the butler. Pack my bags and wipe my ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I remember, absolutely. Oh. Tick the maximum publicity box. <laughs> <laughs> Classic. <laughs> Cheers, Craven. Appreciate that. Who are you, you little sad wanker, mate? <laughs> Coming in with these different names. You sad over that. Think I'm going to fall for that, mate? I've been around a long time, mate. Think you're going to fall for that? We're going for goals. Oh, oh yeah, that Michelin Wedlock look was decent as well. Good call. That was good. What's that Scottish one, guys? What's that Scottish sketch show? With, like, there's that scene where... I haven't actually seen the Scottish sketch show much, but there's, like, just some clips on social media. Like, there's one where these little two lads go out to an ice cream van. And they're like, yeah, we can have an ice cream van. And they're like, do you want anything else? And then he's like, can, can you show us your fanny or something? <laughs> and then she's just like, okay. It just, just shows, shows, shows them their fanny, and they just cut to, like, seven hours later at night, and they're still there, just, like, with a look of shock on their face with melted ice cream in their hand. <laughs> Chewing the fat, that was it, was it, JRA? Yeah, maybe that was it, right? <laughs> Chewing the fat, random, yeah. Oh, Rabsy Nesbitt, that was funny, old frick, man. Dude, I remember watching Rabsy Nesbitt back in the day and just, like, not understanding anything he said. Like, I know this guy's actually like, strong, but uh, 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 Rabsy Nesbitt, like, 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 that, like, that's like, you know, guys can kiss my son. Are you, are you doing your little fucking out of the time, my son? <laughs> that was, that's really hard to understand, Rabsy Nesbitt, wasn't it? Goodness. They said this new Little Britain will be a lot milder and a lot different. Ah, shite then. Hell and Pace were brilliant. Look up Yorkshire Airlines sketch. Oh, yeah, Hell and Pace, another one. What about, um, about, uh, I mean, obviously, yeah, Roddy Corbett and Roddy Barker did some absolute classic sketches back in the day, didn't they? Some absolute classic. Mel Smith and also, who's that? Hey, oh, what's that one with Mel Smith and, um, 
Smith, what's the other guy's name, bro? Smithen, Smithen fucking, you know, Smithen, uh, oh, I can't remember his name, but that was good as well. Shit. I can't remember his name, though. Drop the dead donkey, oh yeah, I remember that as well. So, um, Berbatov, Berbatov, Berbatov. Griff Reese Jones, yeah, that's the one. Get in there, Berbatov, you tank. It's a lovely finish. He's going to rage quit. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. Rage. Rage quit. Yeah, Griff Reese Jones. Smith and Jones, that's it. Yeah, Smith and Jones, that's it. Smith and Jones playing dance sketch. Yes, mate. Smith and Jones was good. Uh, drop the dead donkeys. What I shout when Trashford starts. <laughs> Come on. Indeed, lad. Drop the dead donkey. So appropriate. Oh, dude, that neighbor's hilarious, Stuart. Yeah, man. I, we only started watching that recently. I've only seen a few, but it's funny. Ad. That neighbor's hilarious. You've seen a bit of Roy Chubby Brown stand up, 50 Shades Brown. Oh, my God. Fucking hell. <laughs> I haven't seen that, but yeah, he was close to the bone. Bottom says Ulfric. That was great, wasn't it? Crossplay. Yes. Ch remind me at the end of this game, Jason. Oh, yeah. It's the end of the game. <laughs> <laughs> all right good stuff good stuff right are we close to 169 likes yet guys we're having a pack opening at 169 likes if we get there if not it's going to roll over to the next stream we're on 142 we need 27 likes guys that's all 27 likes and we'll have a pack opening of justice oh yeah crossplay fuck hang on sorry guys <laughs> that's something wrong with my brain i'm telling you I literally have like a memory of a goldfish here. It's just every two seconds I forget what I'm doing. Okay, let's turn crossplay off. Yeah, nice one. <laughs> Matchmaking. Crossplay off. Sweet. Padraig, what's going on there, bro? Hello from Ireland. Nice one, mate. Patrick O'Brien. How are you doing today? Bridge collapse in Maryland. Pray for Maryland. Oh, shit. Another one, dude. Dude, sorry to hear that, dude. Let's get some love in there, man. Sorry to hear that. Another one. What? Obviously, you saw that one in Baltimore uh, collapse, right? That was messed up. Oh, really, Nathan Harrys? You packed Galazzo Okocha earlier. Fantastic. That's just Ireland. Fantastic. Yeah, darling. Really? No place like Stone says Chubby's boring in real life. He played at a wife's sister's wedding a few months back and couldn't even call him a fat bastard. Why not? Wasn't that, like, the whole point when he came out? It would be, like, you fat bastard, you fat bastard, or whatever. How can they... What? What do you mean? Gets offended if you call him a fat bastard these days. Nice fun fuzz... Fun fusion, says my team is good. Nice. What's your team, fun fusion, then? So, I don't know if it's going to work on the vertical line, but if you put exclamation mark Discord in the chat, it should pop up in the Discord. There's a rate my team section in the Discord if you want to share it with everyone in the chat here. Just check out the Discord, and there's a rate my team section if you want to put, post a picture in there. You've got 92 Lam, decent, decent, nice, nice. Little Nathan says, weird angle, but I like it. The regular stream's on also, Little Nathan. Just click my channel, go over to live, and you'll see the regular stream if you prefer the regular stream. But yeah, that's the vertical stream you're in, I see. So you don't get to see as much of the game, sadly, on there. It's good for pack opens, though. Baltimore is in Maryland. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> oh, right, yeah, I remember that, Tommy, yeah. <laughs> Baltimore. That's the one. That was a while ago now, though, yeah. That's why I got confused. I was like, what the hell? That's days ago, lad. Ooh, I don't think anybody's... Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think nobody's... Uh, is there anybody missing, or is... is they actually confirmed anybody's passed away during that whole bridge collapse because hopefully i saw the footage and like there's a truck driver who like goes over doesn't he and he's just literally like the luckiest truck driver in the world literally he's just over the other end by the, by the time he hits the support but yeah dodgy man. dimitar berbatov with the finish really chubby Brown got banned from doing a gig in in, in, in sheffield recently oh shit yeah well you know the wokest went like chubby Brown as well yeah. Um, you're on there at the minute. Eusebio got dropped. Yeah, Berbatov's sick on this, mate. Loving him so far. He's decent. He's absolutely decent. Eusebio got dropped. Wow. Blackadder's amazing. Solskjaer, I love Blackadder. I love it. You think, you think, uh, the first, you think the first one's the best one, do you? 
No, oh, sorry, you think the fourth one's the best one? Yeah, Black Adder goes fourth is probably one of the best ones. I like the second and third one with the Prince Regent and then the Queen, um, Queen, uh, Queen, is it fucking, who is it? <laughs> Queen Victoria? No. No. Who's the Queen? I've forgotten which Queen it was that's being portrayed by that gingerbread now. It must be Queen Victoria, right? Anyway, um, Oh, six missing. Oh, shit, man. That's terrible, man. Oh, that's fucking awful, man. Elizabeth. Oh, right. Yeah, sorry. So it's... Oh, yeah, that's right. Because cause the... Because the... Uh, Elizabeth the First. That's it. Sorry. I remember now. Because the... Whatever uh, the older lady... It was like her aide who sat next to her. What was she called? Nana or something? No. Not Nana. Fuck. Anyway. Yeah, she used to call her Lizzie. I remember now. That's it. No, that was a good one, and the uh, Prince Regent one's a really good one with Hugh Laurie as the Prince. That one's good. And then also the fourth one, Black Adder goes fourth. The first one is probably the worst series, to be honest. It's a bit weird. He's playing a bit of a weirdo. It's a bit weird. It's good, but it's a bit weird. The second, third, and fourth ones are better than the first series, I think. But, you know, classic show nonetheless. Absolute classic. Andy says you should have just waited and got birthed off today. Thanks for that, Andy. Nice one, mate. Thanks for that. In hindsight, you're right. But guess what? We just wanted to get him straight away. Okay? So we did. We did do that. We have indeed lost a lot of money on him. Aishan Akayo. Hello, Aishan. Right. He's banging in the goals for me, though, this guy. But, yeah, let's see what we pay for him. So, as you can see, we paid 346 for him. John Holiday on fire tonight, pig. Let's go. Yeah, he's now worth 150k. Shit, guys, we've lost 200 plus G's on this man. Oh, that is really bad, though, yeah. 200 plus G's on the weekend. Just literally over the weekend. That is awful. Is Harry Kane winning a trophy? No, he's not fan fusion. <laughs> Harry Kane came home to the Germany, mate, to finally win a trophy. The German team, Bevsi Bayern, have won 10 Bundesliga in a row. <laughs> Only for them to bottle it this season when he's there and he's not going to win a trophy, mate. And they shat the cup at the start of the year and everything. It's fucking hilarious, mate. Isn't it? Isn't it hilarious, the whole Harry Kane situation, mate? It is. You've got to laugh. You've got to laugh. Exactly there, Patrick. There you go, mate. Not good. Not good. Yes. Let's get some love in there for those people who are missing in Baltimore, though, because that is terrible. I can walk just going over a bridge. You don't even know what's going on. Just horrible stuff, isn't it? Yeah, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. So the record's four and one tonight. Not bad. Oh, Sharkwind Punez has done bits. Thank you, Fun Fusion, for subscribing to the channel there, my friend. Nice one, Fun Fusion. Thank you. If you're new like Fun Fusion, consider subscribing. We're going to be on here most evenings. We're back on tomorrow to finish champs and get our awards as well. We're going to have a pack opening in a bit at 169 likes. Get yourself subbed up. Smash the bell icon for notifications for more content. Oh, hell yeah. Nice one, Ian McKenzie. We're creeping up there, aren't we? We're nearly at 169, dude. That's beautiful. Thank you, bro. Andrew Johns, the Bundesliga top goal scorer trophy is a gunner's plaque. <laughs> <laughs> Unlucky K, that's hilarious, Andrew Johns. It's a gunner's plaque, is it? <laughs> like a cannon. That's fucking hilarious, mate. <laughs> Alex Filmer, you just literally finished work. Stand outside the place watching the energy machine. Oh, welcome in. I hope you had a good shift, mate. That's awesome. Love that feeling of finishing work, mate. That's beautiful, isn't it? Very nice. Get in there, Alex. Welcome in, mate. Hope you had a good, good one. Oh, he's offside. <laughs> AJ, nice try, mate. You've got to get up earlier in the morning to get me like that, bro. But that's actually decent. <laughs> AJ, that's one of the most creative ones I've seen. He says, I'll just read it out, guys, because it's, you know, people wouldn't read this, but I'm going to read it anyway. He said, do you think Ray 
Penny Body is a potential icon. What's <laughs> about this fucking guy in the chat, mate? Goodness me. <laughs> what Easter egg did you have, pig? I haven't had any, mate, sadly. No, I had a Chinese take in February. When you were on that, bro. Chicken chow mein. No, sorry, beef chow mein. Chicken balls, sweet and sour chicken balls. Kung Pao chicken and sweet and sour chicken. Hong Kong style, mate, with some rice. Went to absolute town. Doesn't seem like the struggles between the box are very blessing. Yeah, terrible decision to go there. I know, well, I mean, I, I, I must admit, on paper, if, if what he wants is, is trophies, it made perfect sense because it's almost guaranteed that you're going to win trophies. It's just the freaky, freaky occurrence this season that, Bund that Bayern are shit. And Leverkusen is so decent. Get in there, my son. Come on, Berbatov. Leverkusen actually had running away with it. So ordinarily, you would expect him to guarantee get at least one or two trophies a season there. You would almost guarantee it. But in every other aspect, I think it was a silly decision. It's just a shame that Man United bottled it. Because I believe that in the summer, with a bit of momentum after Ten Hag's first decent season, if United had spent the money, and I know look, people say, oh, Spurs wouldn't have sold to United. That's bullshit. They've spoiled us loads of players in the past. They didn't want to sell them either. But the, the point is, you know, if a player wants to go and you pay enough money to convince them, it's about paying the money to convince them. Yeah, you would have had to fork out maybe 20, 30 million more than what Bayern paid, to be honest, because they don't want to sell them to a rival in the Prem. Oh, Berbatov hat trick. Get in there, my son. Come on. And he's going to rage quit. Yes, guys, we're absolutely smashing falls tonight and he's rage quit. Yes. So, um, yeah, look, if United have paid 120, 130 mil, I know that's crazy money, but you're basically guaranteeing yourself the best goal scorer in the league for three or four seasons at least. So, yes, it's an investment. Yes, you're going to lose out all of that money at the end of that time because his value will be basically nothing. But in that time, you could have fired yourself to a couple of league titles or whatever because he is a 30-goal-a-season man. You know, so, yeah, we bottled that. But, yeah, he didn't have many offers on the table, did he? It was only really Bayern who were prepared to pay that sort of money for him. So, if he wanted to go anywhere, then he kind of had to go there because nobody else was sort of going in for him properly. Uh, unless he was going to stay at Spurs, but that's career suicide. You're never going to win a damn trophy at Spurs. Yes, they're having a bit of a better season this year, but they're still Spurs and they're still shite. So, I don't know. I kind of think going to Bayern made sense, compare, con considering there wasn't any big offers on the table elsewhere. But it's just crazy and freakish how they're not going to win the Bundes this year and not win any trophies. It's just, just, it's just so Harry Kane. It's so Harry Kane, mate. You can take the kid out of Spurs, but you can't take the Spurs out of the kid, you know? That's what's happened there. He's a Spursy melt. He's actually doing brilliantly, though, isn't he? He's having a good season. It's not like he's not doing well. Catalan says, Bayern wasted money on him. Kane is shite. Are you joking, Catalan? Kane's literally the best striker in the world, mate, as far as I'm concerned. We're right up there. And he's literally scored like 30-plus goals already in the Bundesliga. You're crazy, Catalan. And he scored 30 goals last season for shitty Spurs. You know, you're having a mare, son. He's definitely awesome. We could have had Kane and instead got crippled with Mason Mount and Onana with Popadom hands. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Please don't use that word, Berber. <laughs> Please don't use that word, Berber. Retract. Retract. Please don't make me say that word out loud, mate. <laughs> Not cool, mate. Not cool. Um, Jason says, are you still on target with the weight loss? Uh, not really. I sort of had a bit of a mare this weekend there. Had a bit of a mare this weekend. You know, but... Um, Finish him. Oh. FIFA Presto, you packed Team of the Year Puertes, and she is actually really good. Oh, well done, mate. Nice. Who the fuck is that girl? I don't know. But fair play to you. Fair play to you, my son. Hold a sec. Ooh, she a rebel. She a bad little bitch. She a devil. Ooh, she a rebel. Hang on a sec, guys. She a bad little bitch. She a devil. Ooh, she a rebel. Um, is crossplay still on? I turned it off, Andy. Yeah, I did turn it off, mate. Yeah, so decent. Did turn it off there, my son. Uh, doesn't need crossplay. No, I don't want crossplay on. It's it's slightly easier without crossplay. It just is because you don't come up against cheating PC bastards and stuff. You know, some cheating PC bastards over there. Yeah, maybe Andy. That, sorry, John. I mean that. Um, yeah, that warm-up game. 
definitely warmed us up, mate. It was a good warm-up game, that one. Oh, he's done me, he's done me, he's done me, he's done me. Surely Easter's all about cross-play. <laughs> good one, Andy, there. Good one. Sorry, I keep calling everyone Andy. Good job, Arthur, mate. <laughs> Sorry, Arthur, there. You're just eating your twirl egg. Oh, bloody lovely. Oh, you bastard! You fucking hairy schlong dong! He's beaten me there, guys. He's done me there. No, I didn't get an egg, mate. No. City are the best in the world. Yeah, they're cheating bastards, Fun Fusion, man. What's your opinion on yesterday's result? Michael, it was awful, dude. I mean, the actual result was good because we deserve to lose that five times over. So the actual result, to get a draw from a game, you know, that we should have lost is not the end of the world. But actually, it was shite because we were winning with one minute to go, mate. And we should have bloody won the game. So actually, it was shite, the result. But the actual performance was the big concern. It was the worst you could possibly imagine. It. Brentford looked like 10 times a better tech team. Considering they're a 15th place Premier League side and they're just Brentford, it's just massively concerning, dude. 156 likes, let's go. Nice one, peeps. 13 more to go for a pack opening. We're going to get there tonight, are we? Twat that like button if you haven't done. Sunday and Saturday is a sweat fest. Very true. You did, and a chocolate rabbit. All lovely. So what's everybody had in terms of Easter eggs this uh, this uh, Easter? Let's know. Have you had one or two? And which ones have you had? Cadbury, cream egg ones, twirl ones, Kit Kat ones. Let us know. But yeah, I haven't had any Easter eggs this year, mate. Mini eggs. Oh, yeah, I love a mini egg, mate. Oof. Oh, come on, defence, mate. Split open. Well done, Keith. Well done, Keith. Well done. Nice one, FIFA Presto, my son. Thank you, boss. You go on the other stream, FIFA Presto, and smash the like. That's where the likes count. So you're over on the vertical stream. If you click my channel and click live, there's a normal, regular... Shit! A normal, regular stream as well. Ben Taylor says, best Easter egg was City and Arsenal dropping points. A fair play to Ben Taylor. You're a Liverpool scummer, are you? You bought yourself one as a treat after a week of gym. Go on, Michael, lad. Fruit and nut beast about an inch thick. Wow, John. Lovely. Nice one, FIFA Presto. Thank you, boss. A busment ride. Welcome in, a busment ride. Hello to you, my son. Ten Hag is also gutless. He seems Rashford walking around for the first minute and does nothing. I know, it is very annoying, actually. Like, the moddy cotton of Rashford this season is, is obvious. Even after that guff where he was unprofessional and didn't turn up for training. Back in the team next week. Crazy, man. Yes, back in the game, back in the game. When, it, when are you told for your man to get you an egg? Never, Arthur Hudson, mate. Never. Never, dude. You packed Messi so many times. Oh, I've packed him a couple of times a year. There's, I've packed everybody, but there's only one player, gold player, I mean. Obviously, I haven't packed everybody, but in terms of gold players, I'm pretty sure I've packed everyone, apart from Kinnan and Mbappe. Haven't packed, packed Kinnan and Mbappe this year. Um, FIFA says, why do you look so different on the mainstream? It's just zoomed in there. It's zoomed in, FIFA Presto, lad. Yeah, I don't know. It's zoomed in, mate, so you're getting there in your face version over there but yeah smash a like over here FIFA Presto help us get to 169 boss hopefully pack out open it after this one all right he's got me there he's got me there I'm done I'm done I'm done stick a fork in me I'm done I'll remind him tomorrow for you Shane McCarthy I'll do it now Shane McCarthy actually lad. hang on a second I think yeah let me remember let me otherwise I will forget so let me do it now uh dark friends let's find this group Click on the group, add members, invite group, invite link, copy. Let's go and see where you're at there, Mr. McCarthy. Lad. So you've inboxed me. We've been speaking, have we, on uh, 
Have we been speaking on Insta, mate? I don't know. Where you at, Shane McCarthy, lad? Insta, yeah? Um, I don't think you've messaged me, Shane, lad. I can't see your, your me a message from you. Give me a message and then I can send you the link. Yeah, nice one. Or is it on Twitter you've messaged me? Yeah, that guy was decent, to be honest, Arthur. He, just, he has done me there. Mini eggs are being discontinued. Are you joking, Michael? Surely mini eggs are not being discontinued. Mini eggs are elite confectionery, lad. Absolutely elite confectionery. Why would they get rid of that? Then again, they also got rid of Milky Way Crispy Rolls. So it wouldn't surprise me. Nothing surprises me anymore. 160 likes, guys. We need nine more. Let's have a late night like spike so I can shut up about asking for likes here, mate. Do you know what I mean? But we do have a target to hit, you see. You just played. Oh, nice one, Stan. You you, you blew me away there, Stan. Stan Gambrill in the chat says, I just played you. Good game. Let's get some GGs in there for Stan. You're good, mate, to be honest. Uh, I've only lost two tonight, and uh, one of them was against you, bro. So you're decent, lad. My record's five and two at the moment. What's your record, Stan? But yeah, you're decent, mate. You're decent. John says, can I message you on Facebook to get on the darts list, pig? Yeah, you can, actually, John. It's not the best place to message me, but you can. Favourite player on my team? Um, at the moment, it's Berbatov, actually. At the moment, Berbatov. But before that, I'd say this George Best card, this Bruno card. Really like them. Maldini. This boss, actually. Shit, we need to put Orban back in there. But yeah. There you go. Thank you, Matt the Cat, for smashing the likes. Appreciate you. Right, we'll play just one last game, then. I guess after this, it's going to be time for... Uh, time for pack opening. Yeah. Nice one, Mikheyu Kramer. Yeah, good job there, Stan. He's done well. How are you doing today, Mikheyu, you legend? Yeah, I can't find you, Shane McCarthy, so just give us a message, and then it'll pop up to the top of my list there, and I'll send you a message, boss. Fun Fusion says your team is bad. Put your team in the Discord then, Fun Fusion. Let's have a look at yours. But yeah, my team's not bad. Don't think it's top tier or anything, but it's certainly not bad. You're talking shite, Fun Fusion. It's decent, lad. Let's see what your team's all about, though, lad. Put it in the Discord. Uh, Flying Pig United is my page on Facebook if you want to give us a message there, bro. But Instagram or Twitter would be better than that. Yeah, because I don't really use Facebook. But yeah, you can. FIFA, are you doing RGD or do you spend money? I spent money at the start of the game, like, you know, September time. But I haven't spent money for a long time, no. But it's not an RGG, no, because we did spend money at the start of the game. What the fuck just happened there? Oh, offside, mate. What? Shite. Oh, wrong pass. Yes, mate. Oh, so close. Best egg you got was had spangles in it. Tidy. What the hell is that all about, Ian McKenzie, lad? Spangles. Shane McCarthy, I'm waiting for your response in the chat, mate. Where are you, bro? Nathan Harry, Stesby Avenue, sir. Oh. Doesn't matter who's got a better team. It's all about who's better in the game. No, that's true, to a degree. To a degree, it is. Oh, shit. Do you mew? I don't know about that pancake, bro. But um, in regards to, you know, no, it does, definitely does help if you've got a better team, mate. Like, uh, I've played Lani, who's a pro FIFA player, and, and he played with the bronze team, and I played with the gold team, and I battered it, you know? But then I played G-Wolf with a bronze team, and he played with his proper team, and I battered him with the bronze team. So, yes, I know, it does, but it does help. It does help, obviously, the better players you've got, but of course, you are right. You don't need to spend a damn penny at this game. I always say that to people. You can get a really good team together just by grinding, playing games, playing champs, playing rivals, playing squad battles, whatever you've got to do. You get packs, you'll get players, you can grind, you can build up coins, you can build up players, and you can do SBCs. Oh my goodness, it's a finish and a half. And you don't need to spend a penny on this game to be great at this game. You can build a great team, get lucky at some point in the pack or whatnot, get a great player, get great luck. You, know, you can just do that. Oh no, we're under attack. We're under attack by the ghost members of members gone by. Everyone, get your favourite emoji in there to ward off the spirits of the evil ghost members. Watch out for these ghost members, guys. Come on. 
but it does I do believe it does make a difference obviously you've got better players but yeah fundamentally you've got to be better at the game you've got to be good at the game players only going to help so much yeah Burber you start getting better since you better cards since you stopped buying packs that's interesting well I have had literally no pack luck at all for ages now have I guys none at all for ages and I've opened up a lot of packs yes they are all SBC packs as I haven't been spending any, any money on it but they are shit <laughs> I've been getting some real shit lately we haven't had one banger for months and months and months who was the last banger we had guys it was Darwin Nunes wasn't it so Darwin Nunes is the last banger we had and that was I think now at least two months ago was it long time ago since we've had a banger and, I, and I've opened up a lot of packs over here. it's not like we've not been opening packs we opened up a lot of packs I haven't got anything good don't even play the game that much. We're talking about Ice Giant. I play it a good three, four nights a week. I probably play at least 12, 15 hours. I say 12, 15 hours of FIFA a week. You know, that's a pretty healthy amount. That's quite a lot. It's not like I'm playing, you know, five hours a day, 10 hours a day or anything. But still, usually on average, a couple hours a day or something, mate. So that's plenty. What are you talking about? Get in there, Darwin. Oh, no! Oh my god, it's a Nats ball bag away from being a goal. He's cleared off the line. Should do an icon SBC. I might do. Hey, nice JRE. 166 likes. Lovely. Three away. Just three away from the big 69, dude. Is the Ooh Danish friends? It is from the Vardy clip, yeah. Ooh, Danish friends. Yeah, I've got the Ooh Darts friends, the name of the group from that, yeah. Ooh, Danish friends. Jerome Delons, thank you so much for being a member over here for four months. This one's for you, Jerome. No! Referee, it's a pen. He's fucking obstructed me, my son. How is that not a pen? Oh, come on. Hey, thank you, Jerome Delons. Let's get some fours in the chat. Hashtag four. Hashtag four. Hashtag four for Jerome Delons. He's been a member for four months around these parts. Oh, fuck you, you fucking absolute complete fucking... Finger blasting bastard! You know? Oh, I can't be bothered with that, mate. Right, we're gonna have a pack opening now, guys. Hello, Zeno, what's going on? Um, your mum loves it, mate. She holds hold of those ears, mate, and she writes it like a fucking Merry go round horse. <laughs> it just took me a little bit of time to think of something. <laughs> Uh, yeah, the game is just a gambling simulator. The only content they truly work on is what's in the store. Yes, well said. It is basically, I know. What's sad is I've actually seen people do videos, like people who, I mean, bless them. I don't think they get much up in the old stairs department, upstairs department, to be honest. And I'm not disrespecting anybody by saying that, but you know. There's some people, I saw this video, this guy who's like, I got my job seekers allowance and I can't help myself but to spend it all on FIFA packs. You know, and it is a problem. Seriously, I'm not making light of it. This is gambling to a degree, and people, like, do spend their money on this game, mate, and it's fucking stupid. I mean, I wouldn't recommend doing it if you, you know, you should only be spending money on it if you've got money to spare. But some people cannot control themselves. They cannot control themselves. And, like, if they, you know, they'll spend literally the last couple hundred quid on packs. It's mad. It's fucking mad. Or their last ten pounds on packs, whatever. But, you know, nobody needs FIFA packs, mate. Nobody needs FIFA packs, mate, do you? That's just insane. Right? I think we've done it, have we, guys? I think we've actually done it. Let's take a look. We're two away, actually. Shit, we need two more likes, guys. We're on 167. As soon as we hit 169, I'm opening them all up. We are close. We are close, but we're not quite there. Uh, let's just claim some of our objective rewards here. See what's going down. Nice. We've got 10 new guff stuff here as well. I reckon we're going to pack a banger tonight. Do we have somewhere near like 50 packs? Golazzo Robin Van Persie. Goal Hunter objective done. Decent. Golazzo Goalmaster. 
Nice, guys. We've got 175 likes. Baby, we did it. Break out the red panties. It's red panty night. The live chat's got us 170 likes, baby. Three people. Doid getting 100 likes on this stream, you know. Titanium shin bone. Legends, that's good stuff. Thank you, everyone, for helping us get to that amount of likes there. Now we are going to go in there raw and hopefully pack some sort of Golazzo banger here. That'd be nice. Yeah, 2K start making the game there terrible for making you pay everything. Oh, yeah, I bet that's going to be a guff, guff bag microtransaction fest as well. Who's my favourite rapper? Yours is Northwest, says FIFA Presto. Northwest. Uh, I like, um, I like uh, Southeast. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, I like a bit of Tupac Shakur, lad. I'm old school. Maka Keller de la Shalivi, welcome into you. And Conti Kev breaking out the red panties. Nice one, guys. Yeah, let's go. When will chat be free speech? Never a busment ride, lad. <laughs> We like free speech to a degree, but, you know, you can't just have people saying whatever they want because people say outlandish shit, mate, like horrible shit that really is just unnecessary, you know? Like, we, we, we wouldn't tolerate any sort of racism or discussing of people's religions in a, in a negative way or anything like that, mate, because we are... We're a fun-loving community here, mate. We like to welcome in everyone from all walks of life and we'll just get on, mate. That's what we like to do. So we, uh, we don't want people just saying any outlandish shit in here, really. We've got to have some sort of a line. Anyway, right, let's do this, guys. Let's do this, guys. Let's do this, guys. Right, let's do this. So, let's open up our Gash preview pack then. Um, to start with, classic packs, classic Gash packs. Here we go then, guys. Everybody, thank you, Arthur. Call in the good luck goat with me from the good luck cloud. Let's get some fingers crossed and goat emojis in the live chat here. Come on. Oh, you've got Mbappe, Henri, Perez, Kent KDB, Burkamp, Sadoff, Bernardo Silva, Nesta. Petit, Lama, Norris. I mean, that's pretty decent fun fusion, but you're calling my team shy. I mean, I've got like seven players higher rated than those guys. Your team's bang average, lad. Um, <laughs> nah, it's a good OP team, but your team's bang average. Nah, it's a nice team. It's a nice team. All right, anyway, let's do this, guys. Call in the good luck goat with me. Thank you, John, for the belief, mate. Come on, the good luck goat. Here he comes, guys. Here he comes. The good luck goat is here. Thank you for the fingers crossed there, FIFA Presto and everyone. Let's go. Good luck. Thank you, Mikayu. Thank you, everyone. Okay, just going to start opening these 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 beasts then. Jumbo Puma Gold Pack. These should all be pretty good packs as well. Hello there, One Ball 7 Welcome into the chat, mate. What's good? These should all be quite good packs. Because there's no, like, you know, 77 plus times 3 guffers or 80 plus times 3 guffers. It's all proper packs here. So we should get something quite good. Uh, a busman says your team is shite, mate. My team's decent, lad. The reality is we're probably not going to pack anyone better that goes into my team. My team's too decent. It's a good team. But we're, we're opening these packs anyway. Catalan, hello. You have Totti Mbappe and Totti Aitana. Nice, nice, nice. And we've got Gundogan. First cheeky walk out there. It's a gash one. Gundo. You'll get Icon Prince. I've had that winch three times. <laughs> decent pack, yeah. Nice of Ian. We might actually hit 200 tonight. Keep hitting the likes, guys. We might hit 200. Never know. It's been a while since we hit 200 on a daily stream here, so that'll be nice. Do you like your pick? Arthur, I can't see it, mate. It's literally half the size of a 5p piece here, mate. I can't see your pick at all. But, yeah, go on then. What is it? Like a beach scene or something? I can't see it, mate. <laughs> but fair play to you, though. Exactly, Jason Chapman. It doesn't matter where you're from, what you believe, you know, whatever. As long as you're a sound sort of person. That's all I care about. And that's that goes for life. I don't care about, you know, the colour of somebody's skin or where they're from or their accent or whatever. You're either nice or all right and sound or you're a prick. You know what I mean? It doesn't really matter where you're from. Like, there's good people from everywhere and there's bad people from everywhere. I truly believe that. So, yeah take everyone as they are really in life that's the probably the best best thing to do really best thing to do i treat people how they treat me you know what i mean that's in there fifa press though love that love that rafinha gufferama start here from this pack opening guys Gash packs all on the floor. Gash packs, give me some more. Gash packs, the ridiculously gash. Gash packs, give my cash back. Gash packs, they make me sick. Gash packs, what a bunch of pricks. Gash packs, EA, they're dickheads. Gash packs, ga -a 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 -ash. gash packs all on the floor. 
Come on then, EA. Give me something worthwhile here, please. You know you want to. You know you want to, EA. It's been a while since I've had a banger. Darwin Nunes was the last banger we had a while ago. He was worth like two million times. Not worth anywhere near that now, but he was. He was worth a lot. Yeah, I was a decent player, Captain Woodpass. Yeah, mate. I mean, I used to mostly play in goal, but I was a very good goalkeeper for youth player standards. Yeah, one was regularly winning player of the year, manager's player of the year, sponsor's player of the year. Basically, every season I played, I won some sort of player of the year. So, yeah, not not, 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 uh, not to big myself up, but I was a, was a good player for the team, mate. Yeah. Kanye has some competition. Nice one, I shall RPO. Messi or Ronaldo? Ronaldo for me. Fun fusion at his peak. Ronaldo for me. Messi's obviously a natural genius wizard, but Ronaldo just pure tenacity. Probably just like match winning wherever he goes in his peak. You know, you could put him in Kettering Town. Little, 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 little geezer. Welcome in, little geezer. From one geezer to another. Easy geez, easy geez. He's having easy geez. A nice one there, little geezer. Welcome in. By the way, subscribe, little geezer, if you're new over there, pal. Do hit the subscribe to the channel. What is this pack guff? It's just straight up guff, John. Yeah, I played out on field. I was centre forward, lad. Decent goal scorer, big, strong headers. You know, sort of like the white Emil Heskey. You know what I mean? <laughs> Let's go, little geezer. Nice one. You play centre back and my team won a tournament yesterday. Undefeated. It was too easy. Four and FIFA press. Very nice one. Big dubs. Stefan, get in there. Stefan Herringtonio. How goes it tonight, my friend? John says, cannot stand Kanye. He's a bit of a weirdo, isn't he? But I like his music back in the day, I must admit. He's done some bangers, that uh, that guy. Back in the day, some of his albums, like, uh, you know, um, fucking College Dropout. Is that one of them? Yeah. And what was that first banger as well? His first banging album of Blue... No, shit. What was it called, mate? Fuck. Oh, no. What was it called? But anyway, his first couple of albums absolutely banging me. Got some duplicate guffers here, right? Okay, 86 Kravitz, Shelia, and Navas. Let's just pop them into that upgrade thing. You know what I mean? April Fool's Day. Yes, it is, mate. It actually is, isn't it? Fucking hell. Late registration. Yes, mate. Absolutely. Okay, hang on. Uh, that's that's it. So let's go with... Uh, what the fuck am I doing here? Oh, yeah, SBCs. Exchange. Who did we just get? Kravitz, Shelia, and who, guys? Fucking hell. My brain. My brain is someone else, I tell you. Who was the 85 we just packed? Kravatshini and who? Fucking hell, I've forgotten already. <laughs> These guffers actually have a pack in the store with 99% to pack a hero. Yeah, I've seen that, Aishan. It's pretty mad. I'm not buying it, though, for shit. Uh, come on, somebody must know. Navas, was it Navas, was it? Oh, okay, thanks, guys. Navas. Kayla Navas, thanks, guys. Yeah, might as well just exchange these real quick while we're here. And also Kravatshini. You would do Carlos, but he's expensive. Yeah, he would be a sick addition to anyone's team, to be honest there. Nicking other people's music. Even McCartney called him a twat. Uh, who's that we're talking about? <laughs> Sorry, mate, what? Who are we talking about now? I've already forgotten, mate. I've already forgotten. Mate, how? Are, what's his name again, guys? How do you fucking spell his name, bro? Kravat Shinia, is it? No, that's not it, mate. How do you spell his name, bro? Maybe if I just put Shinia in. No, that's not worked either. Fuck. Oh, Kanye. Oh, right, yeah. Stealing other people's music. What do you mean stealing other people's music, though? You mean sampling other people's music? I mean, yeah, okay. In some of the songs, he does sample other people's music. Then, obviously, it's all added to. I mean, a lot of rap music does that, though. Like, back in the day, Tupac or whoever, they use a lot of samples, you know, whether it's the... You know, all that. That's just the way it is. <laughs> a lot of people sample music in that industry. They just do. Uh, line about him getting bleach on his t-shirt is the coldest line in hip-hop, says JRA. Interesting, lad. Um, <laughs> okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, guys. Kravat Shidi, how the fuck do you spell this guy's name, mate? KV will do. Oh, it starts KV, does it? There you go. Thanks, bro. There you go. That's it. Thank you very much for that, boss. 
Yeah, exactly, Aishan. Don't give him the money, mate. Don't give him the money. Jack Tilbury, a legend, has entered the chat. Jack Tilbury, how you doing, mate? You've been smashing out the darts, dude. You're a beast at the darts, lad. How you doing, Jack Tilbury? Getting in this, the vertical live. Shout out to the vertical live posse over there. We are streaming regularly on the normal landscape mode if you want to get in the mainstream if you click my channel and then click live it's all about pete and bass mate pete and bass are awesome dude yeah they're actually legit pete and bass are good i like a bit of pete and bass man pete and bass are good old school like 60 year old blokes like doing proper rapping mate seriously pete and bass are actually legit they're decent man. yeah you're an old-fashioned rocker fair play Stefan. i love it i love it i love it dude to do the icon pick maybe i might do might do had a few practice today won a game on knacker with 30 dark 30 dark legs not too bad that's bloody good lad thank you united prodigy for spelling cravat shilia for me nice we've got a team of the week there that'll come in handy yeah i'd be happy to get a duplicate berbatov ian because that other berbatov i've got is tradable because i bought him for 340k so if i did get one it would actually be banging it'd be banging because then i could just sell that other one yeah he's gone down to like 150k but it's basically just free though the pack um, open on 169 likes all the time. Yeah? Oh, no, thank you. I've just got a drink, actually. Thank you, though, Sheen. Are you all right, yeah? Go to bed soon. Get yourself off the bed, love. Get yourself off the bed, love. Yeah, make sure you get a decent sleep. You're having a mare. Because you don't sleep. Olf793, hello to your Olfmeister. Everyone says hi, Mrs. P. She says hey, everyone. Um, Olf793, let's go. Olfster, how are you getting on, dude? Well, what a legend. What a legend that Olfmeister is here. Olfmeister. James Paul, what's good, James Paul, my son? Oh, hell yeah. James Paul, what's going down? Pack that icon RVP is cheap and it's still. Jack, nice, nice, nice. Hey, Stefan. Alright, yeah, you get off the bed then. And please don't keep my door open. Because nice. you're letting all of the heat out. Oh, and it's freaking freezing. It's cold? No, it's just cold tonight in general. You're letting all my heat out oh, the door. A, a slug! Yeah, a yeah. fucking slug! Oh! It's fucking huge! Goodness, guys, I've got a bloody slug on the floor underneath me. Where's that come from? Uh, that's that's the... See, uh, that's how you know I'm in a proper garage right now. Slugs find their way in. It's a fucking meaty slug. Massive slug down there, look. Oh, what the fuck's that, bro? He shut it. Hang on, I saw I sort this out. Gungshi, you legend. How you doing, Gungshi? Oh, my God. Let's get this slug in the garden. I'm not going to tread on him. Let's get this slug in the garden here, guys. Right, let's get this slug. I'm just going to put this in front of you. Have a nice night, everyone. Oh, can't you get to Miss P with the good news? <laughs> Come on, Sluggy. Come on, Sluggy. Get on there. Get on there, Sluggy. All right, then. Good night. See you in a bit. Get to sleep, then. Get to sleep. See you in a bit, Mrs. P. Good night, Mrs. P. Say good night, everyone, to Mrs. P there. Good night, lovely legend. He's Have not going night. on the paper here. I need a piece of card or something. I need, like, a something lower that's just, like, flush with the ground, so he's just going to walk on that. Uh, actually, hang on. Let me get this bit of paper here. Oh, come on, mate. What are you doing? Yeah, help get him to the grass. I'm going to, mate. Don't worry. I'm going to put this slug out there. But it's filth, though, isn't it? The slug is the nickname of Slabby Maguire. All right, he's going on to the paper now. I've tricked him. I've tricked him. Slug packs. You reckon I should open a pack with a slug? <laughs> Lift it with your fingers, Braveheart. No, no, no. Uh -oh. Touching slugs, mate. That's not my idea of a good time. Oh. They're horrible. Did your slug slide down inside your leg for a bit? Fresh air says, you know, I apologize. <laughs> oh, my God. 
All right, can I swap that? And is it tradable? No, none of these are tradable. Right, okay, sour brun. Let's just go and um, exchange sour brun real quick. Sour brun. Eat the slug for 200 likes. Oh, no, you're all right, bro. Chuck it in a sandwich. What's the matter with you slug-eating fiends? Oh, I mean, it's a good bit of protein, I guess. You guys are sickening. Sour brown. You would get fake R9? I'd be happy with that, Majid. <laughs> um, right, okay, wait a second now. Uh, Sour brown is her name. Sour. Sour brown, that's it. Oh, she's an 85, shit. Okay, my bad. Uh, the new icon Van Persie Pig 100k I packed and that's really good mate and you and I've heard he's pretty decent as well So that's decent lad. That is good Bear Grylls that little fella. Oh He's my new FIFA companion. Yeah, so we've got a new um, a new mascot tonight guys. It's Sammy the slug Sammy the slug here. He is he's on the paper now guys so I can show you him I'll pick up pick him up before I take him out right guys one moment Here he is old Sammy the slug you want to see this meat bag of a slug? Ready? Look at this guy. Look at that fuck off slug. Right, that's an A4 piece of paper, mate. Look at that fuck off slug right there, guys. Oh my god, looks like a dog turd. It's fucking massive. Ah, oh, dude, right, that's going outside that. All right, back in a sec. Let's open a pack while we, uh. Let's open a. <laughs> Piggy Attenborough, eat the slug. Oh no. You've got to be sharting me, bro. I ain't eating those slugs, man. Let's open a pack then to see what we get on the way back. Eat the slug. I'm not eating the slug for Presto, mate. Oh, it's massive. It is quite big, that one, eh, Maya? Dog shit. It does look like a shite. He's a beast, says Mikayu. All right, see you later on. Say goodbye to the stream there, Sluggy. He's curled up into a little sort of, uh, you know, look at that sl slug trail on the paper as well. What a dirty bastard. What a dirty bastard. Uh, right, okay then, so yeah, that's, that's it, we're gonna go like that, we're gonna go like that, um, yeah, nice one, right, okay, hang on, let's just get rid of this, Thanks, Annie. Berber says, don't spam melt bag. Who's spamming up in here? Old oh, FIFA says, eat the slug. You say, Berber, why are you so hostile these days, mate? Do you know what I mean? No need to call FIFA Presto a melt bag there, my friend. Um, but yeah, six messages, a bit much there, FIFA Presto. Like. Um, Owen trumped my offer, fair play to him. What did Owen say? Owen said, give it a taste for £100. Yeah, I'm not eating a slug, guys. Sorry, that's uh, draw the line. I mean, maybe if someone was to deposit, like, 2k large into my PayPal, I, I would eat a slug. But I'm not fucking eating a slug, mate, for anything less than a significant amount of cash, mate. Because that's dirt, bro. That's fucking dirt, bro. Bro wants to buy pig a coffee tenner for eating a slug. <laughs> yeah, not gonna it, mate. I'm not going to fucking eat a slug for a tenner, bro. Am I? not going to eat a slug for a freaking tenner, guys. You know? Goodness me. Although, to be fair, if I was French, I'd just do it for free, wouldn't I? <laughs> you know, the French, they'll eat anything, guys. They'll eat slugs, they'll eat snails, they'll eat frogs. They'll, they'll fucking eat anything, mate. Horses, whatever. You know what I mean? If my name was, you know, uh, fucking Laurent right now, I'd be like, mm, just, oh, lovely. Oh, lovely bit of escargot without the shell. Let's <laughs> fucking get stuck in, you know? That's what, that's what will be happening, but thankfully that's not the case. <laughs> you think they're poisonous? Really, Ed's music? Stefan says, nah, do it. Nah, definitely not. <laughs> definitely not. If you put ketchup on him, Piggy, would have been okay. Oh! Eat a bit of the slug for an XL kebab. You guys, just stop talking about me eating slugs. I'm not doing it. Never had escargot. It's not on my culinary bucket list. Me neither. I'm never going to eat that shite, bro. Sounds horrible. Really, William? Your cat ate a slug and died? Oh, no way. Dude, sorry to hear that. Are you serious? Fucking hell. Fucking hell, bro. You ate a slug when I was two and had to be rushed to hospital. Shit, me, I Fuck, I didn't realise the, uh, the toxicity of slugs. I really didn't realise that. It's the first I've heard. I never knew that slugs were, were poisonous to consume as a human being. They're full of parasites, says Samo. Oh, shit, man. Dirty. Ugh. 
Callum says, buy a 7.5k pack with coins for a guaranteed walkout. <laughs> nice one, Callum. Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. So we haven't packed anything good yet so far. This is pretty gash pack opening so far. Oh, shit, Burby. You can get lung slash heartworm from them. Never let pets eat them. Oh, good. I'm really glad I didn't eat a slug now. <laughs> Oh, never let your dogs or cats or anything eat slugs, guys. That's a lesson we've learned tonight. You know, you don't just uh, sit back and enjoy high-quality FIFA content. You, know, you learn things, too. Don't eat slugs. Don't let your pets eat slugs, either. Unless your slug is a pet slug. In which case, that might be okay. Although we don't promote cannibalism around here. They host a parasite from eating rat shit. Can't remember the name of the parasite, though. Oh! But it's not good. That's awful, JRA, mate. What? Oh, they're very dangerous for cats and dogs. They can die from eating slugs. Oh, fuck me, that's awful. That would be the Chinese would do it, Piggy, Sir Jason Chapman. Oh, I had a lovely Chinese earlier, my friend. How dare you. Bear Grylls would rip the head off that slug and gobble it. Yeah, but he's a rancid individual. <laughs> like, when it comes to food. Listen, listen. Bear Grylls would do a lot of shit, mate. Bear, there's, there's nothing that Bear Grylls will not eat. Listen, I've seen Bear Grylls out in, like, the fucking some desert in Africa, right? Let's call it the Serengeti. I don't know where the fuck he was. But he's out there and he comes across some... He's got no water. He comes across some elephant dung. You might have seen it. Some freshly laid elephant dung. We're talking big old globules of shite. What does he do? He picks it up, this big old fucking sloppy dump, and squeezes all the fucking juice, water juiced out of this elephant's dump into his mouth. Like it's a fucking coconut, mate. Like it's a fucking coconut! This guy's off his tits! I'm not emulating that guy and I don't want to either. You know what I mean? That guy's off his tits. He literally drank poo water from an elephant, man. He'll do anything, that guy. That's insane. True, yeah, it wasn't the SAS there. Fair enough, yeah, no, you know, it's gotta be a different breed, don't you? It's gotta be a different breed, mate, being the SAS. Fair play. Aishan says, chat's trying to get pig to eat this stuff and rush to the hospital. <laughs> Christ, we could have killed a pig live on stream. <laughs> yeah, it's horrible, Stefan. Horrible. Do it, though. Ah. Oh. You drink your own piss, pig eating. Say, well, I mean, drinking your own piss in comparison to eating elephant dung, mate. I mean, I, I drink my own piss ten times out of ten in that regard. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, not this cravat shitty amount again. Bear Grylls is a long, slung dong, which the youngest UK skater of Everest at 20. Mate, fair play to him. The guy's, a, the guy's a lunatic. I'm not saying he's not a lunatic. He's quality, mate. Respect that people were actually up for doing stuff like that, but it's not something that I want to do. I don't want to feast down on elephant water, mate. No thanks. Ray Mears was great as well, mate. I agree. I enjoyed that back in the day, McKay, you lad. Uh, a bit of Ray Mears. Mm. All right, let me go to exchanges and exchange this crap actually the amount again. Yeah, one bear climbed into the moose's skin for a nap, right? Because it was still warm. Yeah, nutty, mate. Nutty. I remember one where he just, like, caught a salmon as well from the river and, you know, doesn't cook it up or anything. Just eats it raw. I know you can eat salmon raw, but he's, like, it's literally still alive. He's just caught it. It's flapping around. He's, like, <laughs> just munching this live salmon, mate, or live fish or whatever it was. That's pretty messed up. <laughs> uh, who's winning Chelsea v United? It's United, obviously, James Paul. I don't know, Stefan, how we got here. I don't know, but we are here. We are here discussing this, aren't we? Yeah. Hey, we're on 190 likes now, guys. 10 more for 200. Beautiful. Sick stuff. Your, your favourite scene of Bear Grylls is when he's stung on the face when it looks like the elephant man. <laughs> your granddad used to eat pig's trotters and they would still have the bristles in on his plate. Oh, yeah. I, w I want some pig's feet. Every time I come in the kitchen, you in the kitchen, in the goddamn refrigerator, Eating up all the food. Eating up all the chili. Eating up all the collard greens. Eating up all the hogs marked. Eating up all them pig's feet. I want some of them damn chilies. I love pig's feet. Why don't you try and be a dog catcher, son? I don't even like dogs. But that's the beauty of it, son. I grab a dog and I, and I choke it. And I, and, I, and, I, and I kick the shit out of it. Put my foot up a dog's ass all day long. Bang, bang, bang. Foot up a dog's ass. That's my pleasure. <laughs> I hope, uh, Nicola, 
Uh, little miss isn't there listening to me, is she? <laughs> okay, good. Because <laughs> if you don't know what I'm quoting there, it sounds bizarre. That's all I just had to clarify. <laughs> uh, I love dogs, by the way. I'm just saying that's a quote from a movie there. How much is it to eat a slug now you know they're toxic? Still 2K, Jamie. Still 2K, mate. 2K. 2K is the price. <laughs> oh, Friday. Great movie, old freak. Yeah, I love it. So what's up, big perm? I mean, big worm. You just got knocked the fuck out. It's Friday. You ain't got no job and you ain't got shit to do. I'm going to get you high today. <laughs> Break yourself, fool. Love that movie. Classic. 86 Gundogan going to get swapped over here. 86 Gundo. You're a cat person. Oh, fair play. Thank you, make the most of it. Rest in peace to that guy, actually. He passed away like a few years back, didn't he? John Witherspoon, the guy who played uh, Craig's dad in, in Friday, mate. He was great in those. It's a real shame. It's a real shame, but yeah, he passed away, man. John Witherspoon, rest in peace. Every time I come to the kitchen. If you was on a boat and you was going to be sick, do it in a cup, then drink it. Would you stop from being sick again, Piggy? Jason, what sort of question is that, Jason? You've got big issues, Jason, mate. Fucking hell. You got some issues there, my son. Um, don't really know what to say to that one, bro. Sorry. Prime Eden Hazard on Mo Salah. Mo Salah all day. Mo Salah all day. Prime Eden Hazard. Yeah, to be fair, Prime Eden Hazard. It is prime at his peak was fantastic, but I've got to go Salah because I just feel like Eden Hazard just could have could have done more. Should have done more. Should have done more. Mate, who who did we just get, guys? Fuck. Who did we just get? That I was. Oh, was it? Oh, hang on. I'll, I'll remember when I see it. Eighty-five rated guffer. Grealish was it? Grealish was it? Grealish? It's that Grealish melt, wasn't it? Yeah, Grealish melt. Salah or Hazard, guys? What are you saying? Salah or Hazard? James Paul said Hazard. Stefan says Salah. Yeah, thanks, guys. I think it's got it's got to be Salah for me out the two. It's quite an easy choice that one as well in terms of who's better. I'd definitely say Salah all day long. Um, yeah. Hazard says Captain Wolfass. Grealish. Thank you, ZI. It's what I was told 11 years ago. Oh, fair play to Jason Chapman, my son. 84 plus rare gold. We haven't packed a Galaxo promo. Clover 1277. Yeah, sure, you can ask a question. I'm not guaranteed I'm going to answer it. You can certainly ask it, Clover, bro. What's up? As long as you subscribe to the channel, mate. Hit the old subscribe, guys, if you're new. You know what? So we've just hit the new milestone of 5,200 subs over here on the gaming channel, which is beautiful. Um, let me see how many we got. Clover says, do you like cheese? I do like cheese, Clover, yeah. You what? I love cheese. Who are you, Clover? <laughs> who are you, mate? You got someone good? Aaron M, who did you get, bro? Who did you get? Yeah, so we're on 5,206 now, guys. That's awesome. We've got up a good few subs tonight, so shout out to all the new teachers while getting in here for the gaming channel vibes. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Eighty-five plus times two, come on. Exactly, Berber. Yes, his mentality. Yes, to the biggest club in the world, looking like the mission man. Yeah, and just like at Chelsea, like down in tools and just doing it when he feels like it. He's always struck me as, you know, um, a bit of a melter. Oh, look at this. We've got an 87 Romero there. Team of the week. Decent pull, decent pull. Jude look at Modric. Oh, I'm going to have to go and exchange this melt. You've got both versions of Prins. Oh, nightmare, dude. Still, though, better than the kick in the anus, I suppose. You're 3-0 in champs so far. That's awesome, Andy, mate. Quit while you're ahead. Yeah, nice one. That's good. We're not on too much longer anyway, Andy, mate, but that's banging, lad. Good start. Good start to champs from you there. These are gash packs, aren't they, Hoop Man? Yeah, man. It looks like they really, really want us to buy some packs with money. 
Oh, I like cheese, Clover. I'm a big fan. Aaron says 91 Beckham. Respect it. Nice. That's a good one. That's a good one. Would I take Slabhead for a meal? Where would I take Slabhead for a meal? Um, probably Taco Bell, because I find Taco Bell absolutely awful. It's one of the worst takeout food places you can possibly get. It's shite. And I love Mexican food, but Taco Bell's shite. So I'll take him there because I'd say, hey, Slavy, uh, please enjoy some mediocre gash food, mate, that's um, in keeping with your football abilities. You know what I'm saying? So I'll take him to Taco Bell, please. It's nice and cheap as well. Am I doing Icon SBC? Don't know about that tonight. I mean, maybe tomorrow we might do the Icon SBC. Got a lot of packs left still to open here. Taco Bell is ranked wrong. Yeah, it's not great, is it? I wanted to like it. I really did want to like it, but I just didn't. Horrible. Chipotle was nice. Like, uh, when I went to America, I went to Chipotle. Smashing one in the chat, you've ever had a Chipotle. Chipotle was nice. I rate Chipotle. That was decent. But Taco Bell, that's shite, mate. That is real shite. Used to be in the Sea Cadets, did you, Jason? Oh, fair play. I know a few people were in that. Hello, Sailor. What have I done? I don't know. Snails or frog's legs? If I had to eat one of them, I guess it would be the frog's legs. It's just something about a snail really puts me off, man. You take Maguire to the middle of the sea and leave him there stranded. <laughs> Bit harsh, Nathan, but fair play to you. I should start mewing like I do 10 hours a day. What is that even all about, FIFA Presser, mate? Mewing? What the fuck does that mean? Like a cat, you mean? Like going, meow, meow. Chipotle sauce on my subway all day. Nice, nice, mate, the most of it, yeah. Uh, oh, nice, good watch. Godzilla vs. Kong. Sounds horrendously gash, but maybe it is just one of those gash ones that's actually good. Nah, I'm not really up for skydiving ever at Triple R, no. Chipotle sauce is banging, says Mikheyu. Frog's legs taste like chicken. Decent, decent. Yeah, Chipotle's decent, though. It's not, not bad at all. Best Mexican food I've ever had was in, you guessed it, Mexico. <laughs> when I went to Mexico, I just had a few meals in Mexico throughout the day. And uh, Mexico is the best place, you know, enchiladas, mate, from Mexico. From, you know, like a proper Mexican restaurant in Mexico. Can't go wrong, can you? I like the emoji. Oh, right, like that. Okay, FIFA press, no. Right, note taken, note taken. Okay, De Jong. Toenail cheese spread. Oh, DBR, that sounds nice. <laughs> You fucking what, mate? Toenail cheese spread. Oh, goodness. How did you find Mexico? Never been, but even Carpenter can have a Did you go to Cancun? I didn't. You know, my experience in Mexico was literally for basically one day. So when I went to America, we started off in Los Angeles, and then we went down to San Diego for a couple of days. And um, San Diego's on the border of Tijuana, Mexico. So we just popped over into Tijuana, uh, for literally like 10 hours or something from like, you know, maybe maybe like 14 hours or something from the early morning to like, you know, the early evening. So that's that's oh shit. Hang on. We got Kimmich there. So literally I only went to Tijuana for one day. So it's not like I've got great experience of like all over Mexico or anything. But yeah, just Tijuana, mate, really. That's it. Which was on the just over the border of, uh, you know, from San Diego. Um, challenges. Let's go with exchanges. Shit, guys, who do we just pack? Kimmich. Yeah, Kimmich. You've been to Mexico three times. Unreal. Treat like a king. Nice, nice. Yeah, no, Mexico is pretty awesome. I did find the people there very, very awesome. Like, very, you know, it's like quite an impoverished place here at Tijuana. Like, very, you know, like there's a lot of um, homeless people and just like. There's a lot of poverty there, man. It's quite sad, really. But, um, you know, just like the people there, you, you'd you never know it. They're so, like, friendly, so smiley, so, like, just nice. And I found it, I found the Mexican people to be awesome, mate, when I went over there. Anyway, they were re real nice. Real nice. So, yeah, fair play to them. You love Chiquito, but they shut my local. Oh, yeah, I've never been there, actually, but I know what you mean. Chiquito's Mexican stuff. Lewis Wildman, thank you for subscribing. Lewis Wildman, he's a wild man. Born to be wild, get your motor running, head out on the highway, looking for adventure, yeah, whatever comes our way, yeah, baby, gonna make it happen, take the world in a love embrace, 
fire all of your guns, baby. Explode into space, cause I'm a true nature's child. And I was born, born to be wild. Mate, <laughs> what tune that is, guys. You know, I haven't even thought about that song for years. But that's a fucking banging song right there, mate. Banging song. Old school banger. Five more likes. Nice one, FIFA Presto. Let's go. They're keeping a wall. They're making a wall to keep <laughs> to keep Trump out. <laughs> they need to have a, a built-in gun tower, mate, don't they? <laughs> Williamson. Hello, boy. What's going on? Hello, boy. Says he's got had 15 80-plus player picks. Third one, Cashley Cole. That's nice, mate. Not bad. Born to be wild, Steppenwolf. Yeah, absolute classic. Proper music, Stefan. Yeah, you know it. When I explode, it's not into spaces, Andy Young. You are sick of that. You sick of me, Andy Young. Top song, yeah, you know it, Aishan. It's a banger. Oh, man. All of these dupes are pissing me off. Martinez, dupe. All right, okay, let's pop him in at 87. Guffer, exchange. No good pulls yet, Shane. Nothing good. Shane, did you message me on Instagram, mate? I need you to message me on Insta so I can send you the link to Telegram. I don't know where I'm sending it right now. Give us a message, lad. Let me know when you've done so. Uh, 87. 87 Martinez. Bloody hell. Ah, oh, ah, oh, ah. Oh. That's a bit obscene, lad. you got some issues there, ah, 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 bro. <laughs> Fucking hell. He said he'd like to explode all over Maguire. Fuck's your problem, man. Fucking hell, mate. You should be sticking these in the icon pack. Ah, it's all good, Alex, mate. I can't be bothered. Couldn't you sing Blue Moon or you never walk alone for us, Piggy? Nah, I'd rather eat a shit sandwich, lad. I'd rather go outside and pick that slug up and snort it, lad. You know what I mean? Than that. You're talking shite. You got some issues, RRR. What is your problem, seriously? <laughs> he says that slab head can take some liters. Mate, did I not just swap Martinez? Was it not Martinez? Did I not swap Martinez then? <laughs> oh, I, oh shit, I did Modric. <laughs> oh no, guys. Where's your head at? Where's your head at? Where's your head at? Where's your head at? Fuck's my head at, guys. Martinez, man. Shit. Well, both start with M, don't they? Yeah. You got 300 packs saved for team of the year or team of the season. Oh, nice old for it, lad. Hopefully, you're going to get some mad ones then. I should have probably done that. Just start, just saved up an obscene amount for team of the season. But, you know, I just can't wait. It's worse than that image of a woman that shed the phrase, P. Jones, I want to be your girlfriend. What? <laughs> I'm not sure about that, Natalia. Between, oh, Phil Jones, right? Yeah, yeah. Between McQuarrie's legs, snort a slug. <laughs> Hey, Natalia, have you got your Baker Brigade t-shirt yet? Outlaw Torn's received his. I'm not sure if Stephen Shipman's got his yet um, in America, but Outlaw Torn has, so I'm guessing maybe Stephen Shipman has. But have you got yours in Colombia there, Natalia? Let us know if it's come. Faithless classic. Faithless. I can't get no sleep. Uh, I texted you last weekend about the Telegram pig. We're on, on Insta. Okay, Shane, listen, I get a bunch of messages. I'm just going to have to ask you to please message me again right now. That way, it'll take it to the top of my messages and I'll be able to find you way, way easier. Because I'm struggling to find you. I had a look earlier. I couldn't see anything from you there, bro. Piggy, can you do an impression of the man who is covered in toxic waste and starts melting in Robocop? No, I can't. I can't remember that, mate, to be honest with you, bro. I do like a bit of Robocop, but I can't remember that to, to, to a point where I could do an impression of it there. I mean, what about this? No! <laughs> I'm melting! <laughs> How was that? I've never seen... I can't... I literally don't know about the scene, though, so I can't try and recreate it. But if I was melting, that's basically sort of the vibe I'd be giving off there. You know? Owen says some madness in the chat tonight. There is some strange things going on. At the end of Robocop, the guy that melts. Yeah, I, I've seen it many times, but I'm just struggling to actually think of, like, the significance of what you're saying. Like, I just actually can't really remember it. That for some reason. Good night, Jason Chapman. You have a good evening, my son. 
Stay classy, my lad. Stay classy. Do an impression of the Walter White. I'm the one who knocks. That's basically <laughs> So that's it. Can't do much more than that, mate. Sorry. I don't see a quick game after. Oh, hell no. Earth of the man. Done playing FIFA games tonight, my son. Maybe tomorrow. Wrong movie. What's the wrong movie? Oh, oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> man, I don't know who, man. It's the scene. It's dog ass, mate. Fucking splats all over that van. Oh, bloody hell, DBR. Do you like a bit of Robocop, though, man? Thank you for your cooperation. Don't forget to check up on the slug before you sleep. Make sure he's okay. And okay, Jake out of us. I do that, yeah. I think he's gone on his merry way now, boss. So we're all good. And then he says, help me, and gets run over. Oh, shit. That's brutal. Guys, do you remember that? What was that film back in the day? Like, it was proper shy, but it was about some guy. Like, some high school kid. And he, like, something like that happened to him. Like, he fell in a toxic vat of waste. And then he just had, like, this full-on, like, burnt body and face the whole time but like he was a super it gave him like powers he was just battering up all these thugs and stuff what was that mate do you remember that remember that guy he's like some kid he's like hugely deformed from falling into a fat of toxic waste and he's got some superpowers from it basically you know and then he's just mashing people up anybody remember that that sounds about right toxic avenger that does sound about right yeah that's probably it that's probably it sounds about right and he says, Pig, do you fancy arranging a game with someone for 40 minutes and then to be told that they're an old gen? <laughs> pig, do an impression of Pig doing a Scouse accent. Yeah, mate, it's fucking me, lads. The Pig Mason from fucking Toxteth, mate. That's right, I'll fucking put your car up on fucking bricks, mate, and take the wheels, la. No, I'm joking. Uh, that's harsh, mate. Uh, that's, that's profiling right there. <laughs> anyway, no, I'm not going to do that. Gungshi, yes, Toxic Avenger. I guess that's the one, yeah. That must be it. That was funny, mate. That was weird. That was weird. That's just straight weirdness, actually, that. Toxic Avenger. Yeah, probably is that Hootman, yeah. Get in there, Gungshu, you Don. Um, yeah, let's go with this. Kim Itch. Kim Itch. Do an impression of Peter Griffin's wife. Fucking okay, no, hell. Um, nah. No, <laughs> I don't have that in my repertoire. Sorry, bro. I might be able to do like I could do a couple of them, like, "Hi, my name's Cleveland. Oh, it's such a nice to meet you. Oh, hi, Peter. Hi, Loretta. No, 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 no. Oh no, that was crap, mate. <laughs> but yeah, Cleveland. I'm about to, just about to do Cleveland, mate. That's about it from Family Guy, I think. Oh, hi, my name's Brian. I'm a dog. Yes, Brian. This my my name's Brian. Well, listen to me, fat man. I'm a Stewie Griffin and I'm a little baby. <laughs> I can't really, do, can't really do Family Guy for some reason. I struggle with it. Better with South Park, mate. Man, give me some goddamn chizzy pits. I'm hungry. Yes, my name's Eric Cartman. Give me some goddamn chizzy pits. You will respect my authority. Uh, uh, God damn it, Kitty, that's my goddamn pot pie. I said, God damn it, Kitty, that's my goddamn pot pie. Etc. But um, I can't really do uh, Family Guy impressions for some reason. I don't know why. Just not. Just can't do it, mate. Giggity, 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 goo. <laughs> giggity, goo. Can you do Jacko off Bo Selector? <laughs> Jacko off Bo Selector, mate. Fucking okay, hell, uh. Shamon, motherfucker. <laughs> Yee hee. I can't really do Jacko off Bo Selector, not really. Uh, I'll tell you what, though, Craig David on Bo Selector was hilarious, wasn't it? Yeah, it's Craig David talk with a fucking northern accent for some reason. I don't know why when he's from Southampton, like. So random. Need to start a cameo. <laughs> what if Family Guy was Scouse? What if Family Guy was Scouse? Oh, my goodness me. Now, that is a sad, sad thought. <laughs> Family Guy was Scouse. Pig, do Stewie, you got my money to Zane since he owes you, like, 50 quid. Do Stewie, you got my money to Zane. Oh, yeah, yeah, to Zane Miasi, yeah, that's a good idea, yeah. Where's my money, man? Give me my money, man. Where's my money, man? <laughs> Break out the baseball bat on Zane Miasi, lad. Uh, you minged teasing bastard, yeah. <laughs> Yee -hee. Wait, what's this? Dudes, what's this? Hang on a second. Oh, baby Berbatov! 
Baby Berber. Somebody said we were going to pack Berbatov tonight, didn't they? They did. Unfortunately, it's Baby Berber. It's Junior Berber. It's not the 93 Berber, which is shite. So we just got a bit of Berber fodder right there. But somebody did say... Somebody did say we were going to pack that, that Berbatov, and we did. So that's our first promo card of the night. We've got regular Berber. He's literally worth a fuck all. And untradeable anyway. Oh, Jack Grealish, you scumbag. Right, okay, we'll just exchange that then. Uh, there's an Evo for him. Fucking epic, man. Proper bow, I told thee. Proper bow, I told thee. Yeah, classic, man. Craig David. And he just had, like, that Kez, like, that bird with him all the time. Like, Kez, the fucking falcon or whatever it was. Actually, what bird was... It's a Kestrel, sorry. Obviously, it's a Kestrel. It's called fucking Kez. It's a Kestrel. <laughs> he had a Kestrel with him the whole time, mate. What the fuck? <laughs> They're making a spin-off series growing up on a council estate in Liverpool called Growing Up on a Shite Estate. <laughs> Fucking hell, mate. Oh, my God. Your mate is dreading going to the dentist this week. He's having seven teeth out. That's nasty, bro. Oh, in one sitting, that is pretty hectic. Yeah. Nasty. I've only ever had one out at a time. He had a piss bag as well, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you packed 91 Van Percy. Not bad. That's decent, Lee Waters, mate. Come on. Keep the dubs coming. That's good. Uh, right then, so I'm going to now just go and open up the rest of these remaining gash packs, guys, but I'm not holding out much hope for these because we have had some serious guff tonight, but let's just hope for something here. Hey, David. Oh, Mel B as well. <laughs> he used to do an impression of Mel B on the... Oh, you bastard! It's Mel B! You bastard! <laughs> I remember that guy. That was fucking obscene, man. It was so good. I don't know why they stopped making that. They just couldn't get away with it these days. In fact, recently he's had to apologise, hasn't he? Yes, he has, yes. Yeah. Had to apologise. Um, but, you know, Mel. It's Mel B from the Spice Girls! Oh, you bastard! <laughs> <laughs> Two hundred likes, let's go, everyone! Break out the red panties! It's a red panty night. The live chat's got us two hundred likes, baby. Three people died getting two hundred likes on this stream, you know. And I've broken my titanium shin bone. Hey, nice one, everyone! Two hundred likes is big. Thank you, everyone, for hitting that like button tonight. Get in there, boys! Two hundred big ones. Proper crimbo selector. Come have a drink with me, proper crimbo selector. Under my Christmas tree, proper crimbo. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Watch me grapes, you bastard. <laughs> oh, me farmer Giles are killing me. Watch me grapes, you bastard. Uh, phone jacker was good, yeah. Strutter, I don't remember Strutter, no. I don't actually remember Strutter. All right, keep the good luck emotes coming, guys. We need you. Ever seen the Partick Thistle mascot nightmare fuel? No, what the hell? Partick Thistle mascot. I've got to Google this, mate. I'm curious. Nightmare stuff. Let's have a look. Partick Thistle mascot. Fucking hell. <laughs> what the bloody hell is that noise, mate? Is it it's supposed to be his son? What the fuck is that, mate? That is That literally is nightmare fuel, bro. Mate, what the hell is that, mate? Partick Thistle trying to scar the next generation or what? Balls of Steel was good as well, though. It's a creepy son. Yeah, that's so weird, Natalia. Why the hell would they have a creepy son? That's really weird. That's just scary, yeah. Fiorelli, we've got a double walkout. Lisa Simpson on Mev. <laughs> uh, uh, Andy says, Pig, do you remember rem Do you remember Two Girls, One Cup? Um, remind me, is that the one featuring um, your mum or your nan? I can't remember now, Andy Young, mate. Which one? Because there's, there's Two Girls, One Cup, and then there's Two girls, five cups. And uh, it might be one of those that was the one... I can't remember now, Andy, mate. You have to let me know, bro. You have to let me know. Um, you get higher one, two. Yes, let's get the 93 further in, man. That'd be nice. Watch Strutter and you'll laugh your ass off, I promise. Oh, okay, I've never seen it or heard of it, Mikhail. I'll try my best, lad. Berber says, here comes the sun. Do -do -do -do. Classic tune. Gotta love a bit of the Beatles, don't you? The bear stories was funny when he got his cock out on both sides. <laughs> All right, yeah, the bear, the little bear. I forgot about the little bear. The little bear man. What the hell? Oh, yes, he spoke like this, didn't he? The little bear. 
Oh, I'm here with Charlie from Busted. Oh no, you busted bastard. I'm here with the busted bastard Charlie. <laughs> I just remember that one for some reason when he's hanging out with Charlie from Busted. You busted bastard! He's calling him all the time. <laughs> you busted bastard! The bear was classic, yeah. Defo went on Meat Spin website when you were younger. I don't think I've ever heard of that, Andy, to be honest with you. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Literally, I've never been on that site ever. I remember a website called Steak and Cheese back in the day, which was proper fucked up. 90s, um, you know, 90s. Like. Also, Rotten.com, that was fucked up. Back in the day, those were some messed up sites. Like, some real messed up sites on the back in the day that young people should definitely not be looking at. But we did back in the day for some reason. I don't know why. Probably because there just wasn't really as much on the internet back then. I'm talking late 90s vibes here. Hey, have a good one, FIFA Presto. Thank you for getting in the chat tonight and subscribing and all that, mate. You have a good night, FIFA Presto, lad. Stay classy, my son. Thanks for watching. Good man. Let's kick the bell icon like your name was Bosomodo. Esmeralda, the bells! So you don't miss the screens. Nice one, FIFA Presto. Awful, awful, awful pack opening, though. Awful. Your manager's younger than Casemiro. <laughs> uh, are we going to pack a banger between now and the end? I reckon so. Just a law of averages. These have all been dashed. There's surely something good coming. Three men and hammers is banned, but was fucked up. I don't think I've seen that DVR, mate. It sounds pretty mashed up to me, though. <laughs> to be honest, anything involving hammers, you know, ugh, not. Don't think I want to. Don't think I want to see that. To be honest, mate. Fuck you know. Spitting image was good, Lee Waters. Yeah, classic back in the day, man. Classic. Classic. Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. I just started running. For some reason, old school Dirty Sanchez isn't on white YT. Those guys were nutcases. Is it really not? No, it's probably too much for YouTube. I don't know. They did used to do some outlandish stuff. Those guys were absolute nutters. Yeah, they were crazy. Pig in school, people would go over to each other people's computers in ICT and go on meat spin to get them in trouble. It was a bunch of spinning cocks, pretty much. Fucking hell, Andy. Mate. <laughs> Fair enough, then. That's messed up. Probably, uh, probably why I don't know about it, lad. I'll leave that to you and your expertise, Andy. Mate, you know what I'm saying? Lieutenant Dan, I came out to test my sea legs, Forrest. But you ain't got no legs, Lieutenant Dan. I know. Bubba was my best good friend. Luckily, you got all the DVDs. Nice, nice, dirty Santa DVDs. Yeah, they, they, they were, there's some. Oh, man. That, the English guy was his name. Joyce, yeah. Dan Joyce, that one. He was fucking rancid, mate. He'd just do anything. He was fucking horrible, mate. Oh, I mean, all of them were fucking weirdos. But that Dan Joyce, he would, like, eat the most horrendous things. He was just like, oh, he was fucking horrible, mate. <laughs> he would eat whatever he wanted to, mate. It was disgusting. And then just vomit all over the place. That guy was rancid. Have you seen that vid on YouTube too, guys? I have a clue. Nah, I've not seen that in my mate. Somebody was talking about that earlier, mate. That sounds messed up. Howard and Kumar, please don't be Big Bob. <laughs> I heard everything you said. Pew pizza, then vomit on it, then eat it. Yeah, exactly. That's it, Soulshire. Yeah. Oh. Fucking rancid. You should get a graphic designer to work on your profile for playing the game and add the shades on your and your hair. Um, where do you mean? On my profile, it's like the, the picture that is on the thumbnail, you mean, of me. Yeah, I should just take a picture of myself with these shades on, actually. It's a good idea. I don't know why I haven't really done that. I'm still using the same, like, I just basically had a photo shoot, like, three years ago. Not a photo, not, when I say photo shoot, I just mean uh, literally at home. You know, taking photos for thumbnails, like, three years ago. I just haven't taken any more. I'm just still using those stock ones. I need to do that, actually. You're right, I need to take some updated thumbnail face pics. Oh, when they've done the enema and drank it. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. That's just made me feel a little bit queasy right there, actually. Oh, my God. Well, what about the one where they go to Thailand and Pancho has his has liposuction on his belly? He has liposuction and they got this big, like, 
tub, this glass test tube thing of all the fat they sucked out of him, and it's like separating, and it's all fat and blood and ah, oh, and just like tissue, and then they fucking drink that. Oh, they drink Pancho's stomach fat and blood and stuff. It's fucking horrible, mate. Oh, it actually almost makes me want to just heave right now thinking about it, mate. Oh my god. Krista and Funkunku, it's a gash pack, Merrick lad. But yeah, compared to some of them, it could be worse. But yeah, gash pack, though. He drank the fat. Yeah, it's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking drinks the fat, mate. Who, who would drink fat sucked out of your mate's stomach? <sighs> Not just fat, but fat and blood. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, so could you drink my pee to survive in the desert thing? No. You can drink your pee, mate. I'll drink my pee. <laughs> okay? I'll drink my own. You can drink yours. I'll drink mine. Okay? Fuck that. Daniel Lowe says dub. Who did we get? What? I do remember that live autopsy. That was weird, eh, Maya? Yeah, I remember that shit. That German doctor guy, mate. Spinner. Nah, these are gash packs, Captain Whipass, man. Chris Scott says, heard of chewing the fat, but not drinking the fat. Oh, I know. It's, it's just horrible. I've seen we've gone down 10 viewers. I reckon there's 10 people who've just gone over to YouTube or fucking wherever, Live League, or wherever the fuck they are. And they've just Googled Dirty Sanchez fat drinking. That's what I think's just happened. <laughs> Steve-O drinking horsey. Oh, that's horrendous as well, man, yeah. Mason Knight's 91 on FIFA 24. Let's have a Sante. Double walkout. We've got Barella. Anything meaty behind this? Yeah, surely if you drink your own pee, it's a constant cycle of rehydration. Nah, because obviously your body's still going to use some of that water, so it's just going to diminish. You can't just stay alive doing that. Eventually, you know, you're going to get less out every time what you put in. And it's just going to be filled with more and more, like, less and less. It's just, anyway, no. No, it's not. You can't do that. But to a degree, you can. But, uh, no, nah, it's not sustaining, mate. It's not sustaining. Oh, does it not, Andy? Oh, fair play, lad. That's good, then. Um, 86. Yeah, I think so, so sure. I don't know, mate, but yeah, that's right. Oh, in Thailand, yeah, probably. Who did we just get a dupe of, guys? Who did we get a dupe of? Was it Nkunku, or am I just going mad here? Was it Nkunku, or did we just... Who did we just get a dupe of, guys? Was it Nkunku? What about if you add... Oh, you've got issues, Triple R, lad, to be honest with you, bro. Rangers or Celtic? Seamus Mackay, sorry to disappoint you, but um, neither, mate. I say um, I'm going with... Uh, I'm going with uh, fucking our broth, mate. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, out of the two of those, I don't know, mate. I don't really give a shit, to be honest, about Scottish football. No disrespect to you. Let's go Celtic, though. Let's go Celtic. But I literally don't care. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Seamus Mackay, lad. Get in there from Body Scotland, Masson. You choose your hoops, DBR, fair play. Yeah, Unkunku, okay, great. If you get a 90 rated dupe, are you just putting them into the 89 issue? Probably into a, an Icon SBC, Chris. Makes more sense on that one, yeah. Yeah, no, I'd put them into an Icon SBC. Oh, shit, it was Alexander Arnold who was the dupe, guys. Fucking hell. Yeah, let's go with the hoops just for the hoop man in the chat. Our resident Celtic scummer. Let's go with him. Who's bloody Alexander Arnold, guys? Nice one, Stefan. No worries, William. Yeah, last one was in Cookie. That's all good, William, lad. That's all good. Okay, then. Lord Trent. Icon pick. Probably not tonight, Z, but we will be doing that tomorrow night stream. We're back on here tomorrow night with another FC24 stream. We'll, we'll, we'll play out the entirety of Foot Champs as well. And then we shall, um, you know, yeah, we'll play out. We'll finish Foot Champs, get our rewards, and we'll do an icon pick or two and all that sort of stuff. Yeah. Oh, come on, EA, lads. Come on. Just one decent one's all we ask for. We're not asking for a lot here. Just like a 93 Berbatov or something would be cool. Oh, I need to accept your message. Oh, really? Shit. So this is on Instagram you sent me, is it, Shane? Maybe you got stuck in the message request there. There is like a message request folder here. Hang on. Which I don't check enough. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, I've got you there now. It's the omen, yeah? Nice one, mate. Okay, great. Right, I'll just send you the Telegram link, boss. Ooh, darts, friends. Ad members. That's your brother. Okay, cool. Right. Uh, invite link. Copy. Boom. Boom. Right. Okay. I just sent. I just sent the omen. The omen. Your uh thing. Your one. I just can't see, mate. But surely you can join that link via what I've just sent to your brother. Hopefully, I'm guessing. But I, I literally can't see you, mate. That's so weird. Are you sure you sent it to the right place? Yeah, because you're not in my requests, and if I'd already accepted you, you would still be able to message me, so I'm not too sure what's happened there, bro. But I sent the link to your brother, anyway. Hopefully he can just forward it to you and you can join via that. Hopefully. Yeah, Daniel Lowe, not too shabby, lad, not too shabby, lad. Was it not Facebook, says William McDonald? Oh, he's saying Instagram, so... I don't know, did he say Instagram or did he say Facebook? Maybe he said Facebook, actually, shit. It's all good. Maybe it was Facebook, actually, he messaged me on. Let's have a look. Mate, Triple R, thank you so much there, Triple R. I appreciate you, Triple R, bro. Let's get in there, my son. Come on. Triple R, everybody, going in there and doing raw things. Thank you, Triple R, for the super chat, my son. Let's go. Come on, guys. Super, super chat, super Triple R, lad. Let's go, Triple R, my son. Thank you, brother. I can't actually access Facebook Messenger at the moment, bro, so that's a bit of an issue. Anybody who wants to contact me, don't do it on Facebook. <laughs> do it on uh, do it on Instagram or Twitter. Nice one. Hey, R R R says Pig, your best friend has been bitten on the Todger by a poisonous snake. Are you sucking out the poison from the Todger to save him or letting him die? Um, To be honest with you, Triple R, mate, um... To be honest with you, bro, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to give him a semi noshing. That's it. That's the only way. That's the only way. I'm not just gonna let him die. I mean, hopefully he would have been bitten on the side of his cock, so it wouldn't be as bad. You know, if he was bitten on the bell end, that would be a real problem for me. But if it was on the side, you know, and you're just sucking out from the side to get this poison out, I guess you got to do what you got to do to keep your mate alive. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Triple R, you got some fucking issues, bro, asking me a question like that. If he's dying, you know, if he's dying, though, you've got to give him a semi notch. You do. This guy just asked me if I'd sucked my mate's fucking... If, this, if my mate had his penis bitten by a snake and it was poisonous, he was going to die. Would I suck the poison out of his cock? That's what I'm saying. We're not talking about noshing anyone off property here. We're saying, like, what I'm talking about here is potentially sucking the blood out of the side of somebody's penis to save their life. Of course I don't want to suck my mate's penis. The point is, to save the guy, you've got to, you've got to, you know, you've got to do what you've got to do. You can't just let your mate die, can you? Eh? You know what I'm saying, guys? You know what I'm saying, guys? Fucked up question, though, Triple R lad. You're a messed up individual there, Triple R lad. Boomslang Lani, hear me? What's going on there, Boomslang Lani? What a time to come into the chat, la. <laughs> You know, I don't care what any of you say either, like, say your mate was bitten on the knob by a snake, and you're gonna die. Hey, okay, Mark Gale, let me show you my team real quick, boss. Um, if, you, if your mate was bitten on the cock and he was gonna die, you, you, you would have to do what you gotta do, mate, to keep him alive, mate. It's your best mate. Right? So, there you go. Yeah. Exactly. And if you happen to enjoy it, well, that's just a bonus. <laughs> you got Maldini as well. Nice one, Mark Gale says, W team. Yeah, it's all right. It's all right. <laughs> Afterwards, you're like, hey, Snake, come over here and bite me on the cock too. <laughs> oh, my God. Right, let's open up these last two gash packs. <laughs> oh dear. Watch my pack fall. Go on then, Mark Gale. You're going to get my son. You're going to get. It. 
You found a Saddam Hussein money note lying on the floor. How weird. Bro, that's crazy. I've got a Saddam Hussein note somewhere. Actually, randomly. True friendship right there. <laughs> Gash packs all on the floor. Okay, 83 times 10 here. 83 times 10. What can we go for? United Prodigy, mate. It's a life or death situation, lad. All right, here we go. 83 plus times 10. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Benzema. Okay, it's the highest rated pull that we've got tonight. It's a little bit of fodder, at least. But it's still crap, though. It's still crap. But it's a 90. It's a 90. It's a 90. And we've got a team of the week there. Not bad, guys. Duplicate. It's decent. Benzema. Okay. Nice one. Well, that was the end of the pack open there, guys. Rate that pack open an out of 10. That was the last pack. We got a 90 Benzy. Pack open is a 2 out of 10, guys. It was shite absolutely shite really bad really bad i reckon it was i reckon it was shite coco beware says if i was bitten by a poison snake i'd rather die what than have your mate su suck the blood out of you well i don't think you actually would though when it came down to it coco beware and the toxins start going through your body and starts causing you know like issues with you you know i don't know if you'd be saying come on get on your knees mate dog shite it was give me a game here even offline i'll snap you up now nah, you're all right owen another time mate not tonight more fevered out boss Hootman, true but i do understand though are because a tiny unimportant club in europe yeah icon pick now tomorrow night luke we're going to come back tomorrow night and finish off ut champs and do a, do a player pick tomorrow night do an icon pick tomorrow night tomorrow night lad yeah, Daniel Lowe, we're going to do at least a couple of streams a week of darts. Th Thursday night's going to be the main night we do darts, and then we'll try and, you know, do some extras. But we're definitely going to do Thursday night dart stream. Minus one out of ten. Uh, William says, fuck my mate, he's dying. Fuck sucking him off. <laughs> well, listen, you don't have to suck him off, William McDonald. You know, you're not trying to get the jizz out of him, mate. You're trying to get the poison out of him. You've just got to suck the snake bite wound. You know what I mean? You're not noshing him off, William. You know? You've just got to suck the bite. That's the key. You don't have to suck him off. You know what I mean? What the fuck? <laughs> it's like the scene out of Scary Movie stuck in the freezer. It's like, hey, hey, that's the scene from... Um, you've actually been watching um, fucking City Slickers 2, haven't you guys? Have you seen City Slickers 2? There's a scene just like that in City Slickers 2, where they're in the desert. And, um, you know, they're, they're hunting for gold or whatever. And one of them gets bit by a rattlesnake on the ass, like on the butt cheek. And so his mate has to, like, suck out the poison from his butt cheek. <laughs> You've been watching that, haven't you? <laughs> yeah, Boom Lani says, what the bloody hell have I ended here? <laughs> God knows, Lani, God knows. God knows, mate. We're talking about, like, uh, sucking your mate's poisonous D. That's basically what's going on right now, mate, which is fucked up, I know. Sound, yeah. What's that? <laughs> what did you say? I thought you said something to me. Thank you very much, Daniel Lowe. The venom could be in his dick. <laughs> Billy Crystal was hilarious in those films. Yeah, very good, mate. Very good. Um, DBR says, um, <laughs> no, nah, I'd I'd bow out and get my mate on, uh, my fella. You'd bow out rather than get your mate on your fella. <laughs> EVR. Listen, nobody needs you. Don't, dude. You don't. Ha nah, mate. You don't have to. You don't. You're not expect. You don't want them to jizz. <laughs> that's that's the last of what you want. DVR. What are you talking about? DVR. No, mate. What? <laughs> you got problems, dude. <laughs> Delete this vid after you finish. Yeah. Uh, do you reckon I should, hoot, man? Seriously. <laughs> so, in other words, if I found the right snake, pig would. Dude, you got fucking problems. I, I, you, you said my best mate. I wouldn't do it to you. You'd be dying, mate. Do you know what I mean? I'm not noshing you. All right, all right, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god just get the vacuum on it yeah get the old henry hoover out mate that should do the trick <laughs> we're the miller scene william and right nice one guys listen on that note i think it's probably time we wrap this sucker up that's what your mate should have done in the desert lad. <laughs> but we're gonna wrap this sucker up guys thank you so much for getting in here and being part of the stream tonight guys yeah strange questions coming in the chat tonight mostly from triple r there but what can you do eh? It's a public forum. You never know what's coming around the corner next. 
So, yeah, but we're going to basically wrap this stream up there, guys. It's been an absolute pleasure here, as always. You know, thank you so much to you all for watching. We've got 205 likes tonight on the stream, which is awesome. Thanks, everyone, for hitting the likes. Thanks to uh, Zay Asi and anybody else like RRR for any super chats tonight. Shout out to the new members of the channel as well. Big up Sully Griffin for gifting out five at the start of the show. Legend. And everybody else as well, thank you so much for watching the streams. Mark Gale, give us a subscribe, mate, if you're over there for the first time. We're on here most nights. Get yourself involved. Smash the subscribe button. Smash the like button. Nice one, Daniel, Jonathan, Stefan, Owen. Thank you, Owen, bro. Yeah, fun stream, fun stream. Mikhail Kramer, Jonathan Gallagher. I want to shout out all the mods like Lani, Hootman, Gungshi, Mikhail, all the legendary mods. Shout out to all the legendary members in green who support the channel. Andy, William. Owen, let's go, Jonathan Gallagher, my son, Sambo, Connor Walsh, William McDonald, all the members in green, thanks for supporting the show and being members of the channel, everyone else, fuck you off, no, I'm joking, everyone else, thank you so much for being here and supporting the show in other ways, like by liking the videos and just watching and being here, so thanks so much, cheers, Daniel Lowe, thank you, Stefan, Mikhail, Ian McKenzie as well, exactly, yeah, true, 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 darts tomorrow, hopefully, not tomorrow, William, Oh, maybe offline. Yeah, I'll give you a message if I'm around, dude. What do you want me to do, Mark? He keeps saying, do it. What do you want me to do, Mark? Good night, Natalia, you legend. Let's have a good one. Thank you, Hootman. Get in there, Edge Music. Let's go. Nice, mate. Nice, Lani. You got your dartboard set up. Ready, bro. Go in America on Tuesday, but we'll, when I'm back, we will run it. Great. Get in there, Lani. Yes. Oh, yes, you're going to a WrestleMania, aren't you, you jammy bastard? Enjoy it, Boomstand Lani. That's going to be quality, mate. I'll be watching. The Rock is on Raw. Nice, Daniel. Nice. Get in there, Palmaris. Hey, Tommy Boy, you legend. Yes, yeah, speak tomorrow, mate. Get in there. I'll try and give you a game offline as well or something. Or maybe get in a cheeky afternoon dart stream, maybe, or something. I don't know. But nice one, Tommy. Thanks for watching, mate. Getting in all night. Uh, Stefan, must play. Sambo, must play. F the man. Everybody, thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to wrap the stream up there. Great stream as always. Sorry about, but sorry about all that, uh, you know, end of the stream uh, noshing conversation there. But blame Triple R, not me. Do you know what I mean? Blame Triple R. Nice one, Jack Tilby, John Blatchford, Daniel Lowe, and everybody else as well. DBR, Mark Gale, thanks everyone for watching in the Vertical Live as well. Good night to all the Vertical Live legends. You can follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Twitch, and Kick at Flying Pig United. Check out the website, flyingpigunited.com. Follow, follow the main YouTube channel, Flying Pig United. Flying Pig United. Shit, we haven't picked the winner. I've got a few people. Uh, there wasn't that many people who entered, so I haven't picked the winner yet. Shit. This is who entered. Uh, Square Window, Jason Chapman, Sambo, Bristonia Macken, Beats Guy, Luke MUFC, Tommy Boyle, Connor, Promote Peace, Mr. Joshy J. That's all the legends who entered the giveaway. That's the tell you what, we'll do a double giveaway. Everyone, go and go over to this video and comment on this video in the next 10 minutes to enter the giveaway. That's all you have to do. Go and smash a like on it, watch it if you haven't, and give it a like and uh comment on it in the next 10 minutes. Everyone who's commented now in, in the next 10 minutes will be entered into the giveaway and we'll we'll draw two winners tomorrow guys that's the plan so two winners tomorrow go over to this video yeah there's only nine entrants i think there so we'll give some chances to some other people here giveaway comment here boom all right guys go over to the go over to this youtube video i'm about to put the link in the live chat there right there it is comment here and um i put comment here actually like michael jackson yee -hee. comment there guys and uh get yourself involved there I'll pin it to the top of the chat also. And that way, you know, you'll be entered into the giveaway, guys. Go over and comment on this video at the end of this stream and get yourself a chance of winning a cheeky little t-shirt, my son. Nice one. There it is. Okay, it's pinned to the top of the chat, guys. Go over there, smash a comment on the giveaway uh, on that video in the next 10 minutes and you'll be entered. Uh, no, it's not turning into a noshing channel, Stefan. No, bro, no. Nice one. Right, okay, guys. So, yep, go over and comment and you'll be entered into that. We'll do two winners tomorrow. Nice one, peeps. We'll give uh, double chances there for peeps. Yeah, nice. All right, guys. Much love. God bless. Piggy loves you. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Follow us all those places. Links in the description. Follow the main channel, Flying Piggy Night. Follow this channel, Flying Pig Gaming. Click the bell icon for notifications. And I'll see you in a bit. Nice one, legends. See you later on. Piggy loves you. And remember, when the seagulls follow the thrawler, this is because they think sardines will be thrown into the sea. Thank you very much.